Well, I'm already enraptured by the music. I did not listen to anything last night. Good for more experienced pioneers. Advanced pioneers. First time pioneers. Wait, were they both? They both were. I don't think I want to see... Oh, that's a desert. <laughs> Let's do the fields, huh? <gasps> How do I delete session? I started session with Meg... We'll do Wells Bow. Hello. It's been a little bit. A couple of days. We're post Christmas. And I'm early. And I have a candle that smells like watermelon bubblegum. Attention, Pioneer. The following instructional video is a summary of your impending duties as an exoplanetary pioneer for Fixit Incorporated. Fixit pioneers have three cyclical assigned pillars of work to ultimately accomplish project assembly. Use provided blueprints to build the necessary buildings. Chart the planet and gather resources to provide desired results and improve your infrastructure. Make sure to report any unusual discoveries to R&D for analysis. Expand your factories, outposts, and pipelines through automation and augmentation. That's it. Get to work and be effective. Warning, planetfall imminent. Please remain seated during full procedure. Atmospheric entry in 5, 4, Three, two, one. Planetfall procedure initialized. So, the two arrows and the... I don't know, it looks like a face to me. They're very off-putting. Also, I'm getting very Subnautica feel out of this. In. Yes! Oh, look at the textures! Oh, a little sparse grass! Please ensure the integrity of your multi purpose exploration suit is at 100%. Remember, efficiency first. Godspeed. Godspeed. Welcome to Planet Massage 2 ABB, your designated sector in the binary star system of Akija. I am Ada, also known as Artificial Directory and Assistant, what tasked the? to support pioneers such as you in their mission. You are the third of your sector to survive Planetfall. Congratulations. What the fuck is Note, it? Outside of Majestic. Introduction initialized. Welcome to onboarding. I need the Storm King Sword. First objective, please dismantle the drop pod. The resulting materials will be repurposed to construct a habitat and utility base from now on referred to as the hub. The hub. Note, fix it incorporated as cost effective and efficient. We do not waste. Oh, the popping is so bad. I mean, that's gotta be my settings. I started this last night and fiddled with settings a little bit. I just kind of wanted settings and stuff like that. All important fix See if I can even run this. Location is recorded and stored in the codex, including these steps. Hey, okay. oh, to open the codex. 
iron ingot, iron plate, iron rod, xeno zapper, the hub, craft bench, yada yada. Second objective. Please ensure you have your fixit incorporated xeno zapper equipped before leaving the drop zone. Note. According to Fixit regulations, every pioneer should have access to a means of defense against extraterrestrial threats. Tab and drag. Third objective. Please familiarize yourself with the resource scanner to find iron. Note. The acquisition of iron is considered essential in preparation for all future objectives. Oh, damn, that's a floaty-ass jump. All right. Okay, there we go. We can do options now. I want to see... Whoa! Field of view. Wrong thing. I saw this before. I want to do that. Turn that off. Apply. Confirm. Oh, there we go. Whoa. Uh. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, man. I really dislike V-Sync nowadays, but I don't think I can get away without using it. Oh, wait! Uh, no, there's still some... I notice screen tearing very easily, and I really hate screen tearing. Okay, uh, V to scan for nodes. V. Oh, hold V. What is this? Barrel nut? Okay. Well, we can just grab leaves. All right. Be cool. Be cool. Build the hub. Note: To complete this objective, the resources salvaged from the drop pod will be consumed. Bro. Caution: Ensure the hub is built on spacious open terrain close to the presence of iron sources. Failure to do so will likely result in non-optimal progress. Non-optimal? Okay, so they just want me to build out there. That's doable. Impure. All right, we're just going to smash a little bit. What's this little fella? What's that little? Why are things just disappearing on me? <gasps> Some kind of weird bird. You okay, little weird bird thing? Oh, I can crouch. Here, oh, shit, we got feet. Alright, um... To improve efficiency, the hub is best built near iron nodes. The hub can be built by using Q. The hub. God. Just slap it here. Ah! Alright then. Congratulations. You have unlocked. 
Hub feature. All right, Manual then you can get zapped. Hub feature. Hub terminal. Fifth objective. Complete hub upgrade one. Note, the craft bench and hub terminal are essential for progression to the next objective. Ugh. Holy shit. I broke the poor boy. Oh well. I did not hear anything that robot said. Uh, the hub upgrade and their cost can be found activated in the hub terminal. So I have a craft bench now. Iron ingots. So I turn ingots into plates and ingots into rods. Okay. I just... Craft. Oh, I have to hold it. Uh. All right, what am I even making this for? Uh. I need Ten iron rods, okay. At least that one's quicker. Okay. Storage. Congratulations. You have unlocked building workshop. Building Equipment workshop. portable miner. Inventory additional slots. Hub feature personal storage. Sixth objective. Complete hub upgrade two. Note. Portable miners require no power and will mine a node until their inventory is full. Note. Multiple portable miners can be used on a single node. Okay. Uh, is that a thing I can do with the craft bench? Q production. Craft equipment. Okay, so I need... A couple of these. Okay. It says left control to snap to grid, but I don't see no motherfucking grid. Oh, I see. I have no idea if that's a good spot. We'll just, you know, pretend it is. It's fine. Portable miner can already make it. Nice. So what was it? Tab, right? Yeah. All right, the portable miner can be placed nearby a resource node by pressing le left mouse, mouse bumper while it's equipped. Do your thing? Look at it. It's a beautiful boy. All right. And while that does its thing, I will go over here and make some stuff.
Oh, I can just hold space. All right, that's good. <laughs> I need to look at my hotkeys. Good lord. I mean, I guess I could build a couple of these, huh? Zittle. All right, what else can I... Th oh, I needed... What did I need? Twenty iron rods and ten iron plates. Here's ten iron plates. And there's twenty iron rods. Beautiful. Oh no. <laughs> Did I fuck up that quick? What is this? Congratulations. You have unlocked hub feature, biomass burner, scanner feature, copper, new buildings and recipes, which can be found in the build menu and craft bench, respectively. Oh. Uh, Seventh objective. Look at this big boy. Three. Note, connect buildings to a biomass burner for power. Note, buildings such as the smelter require a recipe to be set. Advice. Automate the smelting process and use portable miners for optimal results. Okay, how does that work? Alright, hold the to select the uh, select the buildings like the smelter require a recipe to be selected and power to function. Biomass burner consumes biomass, obviously. How's the uh, portable miner doing? 20 ore per minute. All right. I guess I'm gonna look around for copper. It would behoove me to bring portable. I think 25 of these, and then five of that, and 10 of this. Work. Oh, the equipment. I'll go for another one, why not? And then I look for copper. This way up on the ridge. God, I wonder if leaves are actually good for the biomass burner. I can't imagine they are. whole bunch of them though all right I think yeah that must be my copper down there Mendel, can you join me? Yeah, you can hang out. Uh, if you mean like in game, probably not. But what up? Uh, let me. Da -da 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 -da. How do I tab? Hands. All right. How you doing today, bud? No, 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 no. no. Be cool. Just be cool. It takes no effort on your part to not do anything. <laughs> oh, 
Thank you. All right. Uh, I have two of these. You can go ahead and do your thing there. And you can go ahead and do your thing here. And I guess I'll come back for these things? I don't know. What does it take to make a smelter? Copper wire and iron bar. Well, well, I don't even remember what they're called. <laughs> oh, shit. This is going to be one of those games. <laughs> the brain does not work appropriately. What's the gas? I have 124 hours, like... Oh, shit! If you get to it, it disappears. That's... interesting. Oh, it's so majestic! I really do need the Storm King Sword. It's like some Demon Soul shit in there. That's 120... I had seen... So, on the Steam sale, I bought this and Dyson Sphere program, because, I don't know, I have Oxygen Not Included, and that one's a little too... Physics-y? I don't... Obviously, it's not the same game. It's not like a factory simulator, right? Oxygen Not Included. But I feel like it's in the vein. Dude, it takes you nothing. Literally, it costs you nothing to do nothing, bro. But I was looking around for something to just, you know, eat some time. Oh, 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 oh. And it came down to this, um, Vectorio, and some people were recommending Dyson Sphere Program, right? And I have a friend who, he, he's seen videos for this game, and he was pretty interested in it. And I do know it's multiplayer, so I was like, ah, oh, fuck it. You know, it's on sale. I'll go ahead and give this a try. And basically, here we are. But I ended up getting Dyson Sphere Program as well and skipping out on Factorio. Because Factorio, I don't know, something about the first-person nature of this game kind of like... You get that personal feel for it, right? Like, you're, you're in here, you're clicking things. And then Factorio is literally just... It seems fully automated, like... I gotta go make copper. But that doesn't appeal to me as much. So here we are. We'll see how Dyson Sphere goes, though, as well. I'm kind of looking forward to that one, because space has always been something I've really enjoyed. And I really... I, I don't know, there's something about... Space games are either I love them or I fucking woo. love this game. You're bored, so you've been wanting to join people. I feel like when I get my bearings, I might, you know, open it up to the world. But I don't even know what I'm doing. Like, I literally just started this game 27 minutes ago. Uh, so I need copper ingots now? Yeah. Uh, of course, I, I mean, I guess I didn't necessarily start it 27 minutes ago. I did. Last night I booted it up to get some settings down to make sure OBS can stream it while I play it. Because I don't have the best computer in the world. At least for wire, we get a two for two on that one. That's nice. Cable. So now we can build a smelter. My <laughs> current build <laughs> is not so good. It's 
Is that, is that in? Which one's? Okay, so in is orange, out is green. What up, Sharkfield? God, has it been? Is it that time already? Shit. Uh, I'll just slap it here. I have to have my graphics all the way down just so my computer can run it. That's. I feel like once I really get going with building the stuff, everything's gonna tank. How has it been over two years, man? I've been an affiliate for like three years now. Marinate on that shit. It's not okay. How you doing today, bud? Well, let's just build it here, I guess. Alright, so... How, how do I connect? Power generators in most buildings only have a single power line connect. Need to make cables out of your wires? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Alright, well, it doesn't cost me much of anything. Are, are cables something I slap down? Used to crafting, primarily used to build power lines. Two? Currently building power line. Gotcha! Press two and then connect the uh, biomass to the burner and the smelter. Oh my god, I need wire and concrete? God, <laughs> give me a second. This is taking me a moment. Build his left nostril. Look on the bottom is Bernard, then on the smelter. Oh, I see. Oh! I see. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Oh. And I... 30 per minute of that? Yeah, put the- Oh, I'm trying to put the stupid ore, my bad. Or, I was trying to put the ingots like an idiot. Alright, so I guess this thing's full, huh? Grab it all. Alright, get back to it. Alright, so what do I need to... Full tank of gas in car, food in the fridge. Huh, how was everyone's Christmas, by the way? Power pole. Can handle up to four power line connections. Connect power poles, generators, yada yada. All right, so I need 20 wire, five more iron rods. Okay. Five more of this. And 20 wire. I appreciate it, Mendel. I'm probably gonna need a lot of help because I am dumb as shit. It's pretty chill. Brother was sick, so couldn't come down, but overall I had a good time just sitting and talking. Oh. It's a relaxing Christmas. It's like milestone. Uh, uh, upgrade. Eat. 
Congratulations, you have unlocked Scanner Feature, Limestone. New buildings and recipes, which can be found in the Build Menu and Craft Bench respectively. Eighth Objective, Complete Hub Upgrade 4. Note, use Power Poles to expand the power network for optimal results. Okay, okay, I barely paid attention to that. So, I'll grab that shit. What up, Ali, huh? Yeah, time to build a person launching can in the break reality. We'll see how how it goes. I've only seen one video of a guy doing that. And that was, God, two years ago or something? That was a while ago. But I figured today I'd do a bit of this, and then, um... If I don't get fully absorbed into it, which seemingly I very well might, I was intending to move over to Sekiro. Ooh, look at that little fella. A blue power slug. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Help. Help. <laughs> no! Help! No! Your boy is stuck. Send help. I thought I was gonna have there was no way either if I pressed escape I would not notice that respawn button absolutely zero fucking chance where's my ability to eat glass huh how you doing Aleha? Huh? Yeah, that was the initial thought process today, though, and that's what in my um my notification. It was one of those like satisfactory and then Sekiro, because I kind of had a feeling if I play this game, I'm going to get absorbed through no fault of my own. But we'll see. Sekiro is on the list. I that that will be played. Don't worry about it. Pasty with a side of internal bleeding. Ah, oh, yes, the glass. All right, so we get a couple of these. A whole bunch of... Grab all that. Sometimes new shit is just fun. Can't put it down. My problem is that I recently bought, like, 10 or so games. And I bought at least five of them with no intention of streaming them and as like satisfactory I had no intention of streaming and then I booted it up and I was like uh, maybe <laughs> uh, maybe and here we are all right so copper only stacks to 100 so that's not ideal but I ended up getting Sekiro and Baba Is You. Both of those will get streamed. XCOM was for me. I had I picked it up, played it for like an hour and put it back down. I don't even know about that one. Uh, what else did I get? Blasphemous was to be streamed. Dyson Sphere Program is for me, but we'll see how that goes. What do I need here? What the concrete? Oh yeah, what? All right, uh, power poles. Buildings like the constructor require a recipe to be selected and power to function. Constructor. I need our reinforced iron plate. Okay. I need screws and iron plates and to make screws, I need iron rods. <laughs> okay. 
Some people might prefer games with narrative on streams, but a game like this is kind of more about making your own fun. See, that's the thing is I'm never good at making my own fun. I'm an idiot. Like, through and through, I'm a fucking idiot. It's much... I find it better to... My favorite streams are when I watch a movie with you nerds. I don't have to do anything. We all get to enjoy the movie. Like, Detroit Become Human? Bellissimo. That was fantastic. Uh... Iron rods or screws. See, my problem is I just have, like, little to no imagination. Alright, whatever. We'll just call that good. Plates. I just kind of do what's in front of me. And if there's nothing in front of me, I don't do anything. That might be a problem. How many plates did I fucking need for this thing? I did not... Okay, just two. We've got two. My inventory is already shot. Okay, can I extend the power line? No. So I need to make a power pole now, correct? I'm missing concrete, concrete. Press F, look at the cable and destroy it. And connect and connect. Okay, so that'll work temporarily until I can make concrete. I need limestone. I don't think I've seen limestone before. I was just going to connect the two like that so that I can make concrete, but... We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. So that thing auto makes the stuff I need here. All right, all right, all right. So take all the crap out of this. Go over here, click this. I want concrete. Uh, let's be fire. And away it goes. Won't have to worry about it. Is limestone? Yes, I can scan. I th which, okay, it's pretty close. Though I should bring a portable miner. Probably a good idea. Power pedals. I could probably just destroy some of this shit. Like, I'm not sure I just need the random materials because I'm going to get lost in the sauce. I know this has no power, but I will do that for now. I needed to build a portable miner. Oh god, two at a time. <laughs> I'm gonna go grab the one at my iron. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. I'm gonna go collect this this little boy. The worst part about starting out in games like these, I can't throw this away because I might need it later. Oh, there's a little bit of that. I feel like I'm pretty good at avoiding that. Because I'm under the... Im Shit! Die. Woo. Bitch, you guessed.
Feste. Oh, there's health regen. Up to three bars. I'm going to die a lot. I think it was 25 limestone or something like that. Oh god, we're gonna be here forever. That's, I have noticed there are... I imagine in a game like this, there's not too many superfluous items. Superfluous! But in a ton of the survival crafting games, shit like that, there's just so many items and things to take up your inventory that literally don't do anything. They're just there to jape you into collecting them and ruin your inventory. Okay, it was... I thought it was like 25 to make one. It was three. That dude is strong as fuck, just breaking rocks with no hammer and that chisel. Um, for Christmas, my nephews. I don't know if it's like popular nowadays, but there's um some kind of archaeologist toy to where they bury something cool. I say bury, they encase this cool toy inside of limestone or something like that. And it's up to the kid to chisel it out of the stone. Like they give you tiny little plastic toys and you just chisel the motherfucker until you get the toy. I've always thought that, or not always, but I've thought that was kind of cool. Read the berries and your humor in the nuts. What? <laughs> oh, do, I do have berries, right? <gasps> oh, eaten for half segment. Time to eat my nuts. I was just going to use this as fuel. Good looking out. All right, uh, let's see. I have the concrete now. We can make the pole. I have no idea where I'm going to put this pole. That seems as good a spot as any, fuck it. Dismantle the- Oh, it's got a little wreath on it! Overlapping clearance? Did I get this shit, uh... Alright, click that, click that. What does that mean? Floor too steep. Oh, that's I'm not looking that up. Whoops. <laughs> All right. Uh, I've seen toys like that in the past. So make sure to give them to your sibling kids so they can deal with the mess. Uh, yeah, that's yeah. <laughs> and they play with it outside. It's limestone, so it just washes away. So not my shed, not my problem. Didn't this thing say it only had like 80 per minute? How is this thing trucking so hard? I... How did I end up on copper ingots? Wasn't I just making... Wire? Constructor was making more. I, it's... Please don't judge me too harshly. The brain is not what it once was. Let's see what the upgra upgrade for. So I need concrete, a metric fuck ton of plates. Good God.
Slap that back there. <laughs> Just the leaves clipping through shit. I liked it. All right, 10 cable. I have the concrete necessary, so just the metric fuck ton of iron plates, of which I have plenty of ore. All right, bump. Get the smelting. Miner was supposed to go on the limestone. I got one. I stole the one from the iron. Yeah. And then put it over at the limestone, which I guess I can collect now. And then had to make a new one for the iron anyway, so. The things I needed to do got done in the end, I guess. And I can... While that smelts that, I can use this opportunity to, I guess, make some ironing ips myself. We're gonna be here a while. Yeah, I'm kind of curious as to what... I guess it would be a little obnoxious if the music just constantly went. But I wish that it did. You know? Though, I feel like Minecraft would have that same problem. Like, when good music comes up in Minecraft, it's like this nice, nice moment to jam. And I'm sad to see it go, but I guess I'm happy to hear it because I'm sad to see it go. The other reason I was willing to give this such a try, this is Coffee Stain. Like, I might not be the biggest fan of Goat Simulator or whatever the fuck that is. But Coffee Stain did Sanctum, and I fucking love that game, and its sequel. They're fantastic, and I wanted more of it. And then they did Goat Simulator, and everything fucked up. All right, this one won't take as long. We'll get our 75. Actually, this will put me at 66. That's not great. God, I love Sanctum, though. What a great game. Yeah. Let's go see how many we've made. Oh, hey, that smelter's actually trucking. Wait, were we actually just sitting there clicking space for two minutes? I don't want to believe that. Thing. Oh, I don't need to make this myself. This is absolutely done. All right, I guess you can make concrete. Let's see, what do I get? Oh, uh, I have to make the cable, which is very quick. And upgrade. Player upgraded. What the fuck does that mean? Congratulations, you have unlocked building, conveyor belts and poles, mm. inventory, additional slots. Ninth objective, complete hub upgrade five. Note, portable miners cannot be connected to conveyor belts. Advice, when planning the construction of buildings, note the placement of conveyor belts. Uh. <laughs> oh no. Transports up to 60 resources per minute used to move resources between buildings. 
can be used as a connection for conveyor belts. The height of the pole can be adjusted, useful for route or useful to route conveyor belts in a more controlled manner and over long distances. So realistically, I could feed something cool into there. The problem being that I have them backwards. I have my input. <laughs> I have the input back here, and I have the output of this one. Oh no. I mean, I could just destroy this stuff, probably. We're just gonna take that. Thank you. Destroy, destroy. Let's try this again, shall we? How do I want this to look? Oops. So we want the smelter to feed into the constructor, so that's something to look forward to. I guess I can put it like here? Why up? Does that work? It, it lets me build. Why does it let me build that? I want to build it now. Or just make a really long conveyor. Oh, stilts. Huh. I sure hope I'm getting full materials back for this. <clears throat> Let's give it some leeway or some headway. Build that like that. Strike. Okay. I need an equipment workshop. I want it. There we go. I think that's good. Beautiful. <clears throat> what else? All right. So conveyor belts. I can just connect the ass into this to the. Nope. I need plates. Oh my god! <laughs> I need plates. So I assume these conveyor belts weave appropriately. So like if I wanted to send it that way and then loop it back around, I could do that, I assume. Okay. <clears throat> So, how much iron do I have? I have 19 iron ore. Which copper do I have? Eight. That'll feed copper. Oh, I need to hook up power. Oops. And that feeds the copper into the constructor, and the constructor automates. Cool! Feed me! Oh! Wanna help join you? Like I said, I'm gonna. Oh, that's backwards. I'm going to try to get everything down, st like, straightforward, and then, I would say, after a bit, 
I'll probably open up something interesting. It's, uh... God, my buttons. Okay, so I can't move, like, hmm. So I still have to personally collect from the portable miners. What do I need to upgrade to the next one? Iron rods and cables. Okay. Oh, and then I get my miner. Perfect. So, if I can make another portable one here... Nope, that's not it. It is the equipment. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Literally everything but the right one. Tab. It's gonna go. And this can go here. So I am curious about the difference between impure and pure. Do I get more per strike? Oh, I get way more on pure. Okay. So pure is to, to manually mine. I guess. You are right, Aliha. This is a strong boy. Maybe it's like a future space chisel or something made of unobtainium. What's that ride? Slick like recipe, ironing it. So got plenty of ore. Isn't industry wonderful? Wait a sec, what happened to all the copper I got? Wasn't I making copper? Did I automatically collect it? Huh. It doesn't look like I automatically collected it, but then again, I don't know. Soon you'll be polluting the beautiful scenery with coal power plants. Look, there's been a floating manta ray. Some kind of like, oh shit, son. I've walked over this a couple times and I never noticed the fucking Niagara Falls over here. I want to build a factory on top of it. Can I jump? That would be bad, yes? Jumping? What do they call that? Call of the Void? Oh, but see- What is going on over there? To reiterate, there has been some flying manta ray thing that I just want to cleave. There it is. I want to bring low the sky. Look at that big fellow. Where's my zoom? I guess... You know, I don't have to wait this long, do I? I, I could make more things. Instructor... Oh, I need plates. No, what? I destroy what? Oh, we're actually out of power. I was like, I destroyed the thing? No, I did not. Well, that's not gonna last very long. Enforced iron plates. Need screws. Have one making iron stuff, have another making copper stuff. It's genius! Oh, I could make 
these rods into screws if I needed them. I can do another constructor here, feed these rods into this, that to automate screws. All the possibilities are endless. Fuck, I need rods. <laughs> God damn it, why are you so difficult all the time? Let me go uh, make the reinforced iron plates or whatever. Oh yeah, here's the music. All right, let me, uh, iron plate. Are you gonna, gonna do the thing? Add in more ore, grab more ore. Oh, I'm a little excited to just see this work. Whole bunch of ore. Build a smelter. Build a constructor. And a conveyor. And I have no plates. Give me that shit. Actually, I have no ore. Uh, I did pick up a bunch of iron though, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. And turn that shit into plates. I have to connect this to another pole, right? This one's three out of four. Oh, what if I connect the pole to a pole? How about that shit? Oh god, I can already see the web. Oh no, what have I done? What was I doing? I, what, what was the end goal here? Okay, rods. I need rods and I need cable. Okay, no more plates. Thank you. Let's go collect that copper. That's the other part of this, so like, Factorio, I'm sure it's a beautiful game, right? But it did not seem like exploration was a huge factor in that game. To where this one... What the fuck is going on over there? I want to know what that is! Look at this big, weird, meaty dude! That's stuff that I'm about. I feel like Subnautica was... Well, maybe not. Maybe there was no influence at all, but this does give me, like, a weird Subnautica vibe to it. One day you're going to die. What is this? So is there a limit, like, hmm, I have this biomass generator, is there a limit to the amount of things it can actually power? Like, can I overdraw its electricity? I've been curious to pick up this game myself after watching videos of the possible shenanigans. 
I feel like if that's something you're in into, you have to be of the mindset that you want to break it as best or as quickly as possible. Or maybe not quickly, but you're going to want to break it. Okay, I see. It's a, uh, what is that, a megawatt? So it can only produce 20. These are eating up for a pop. So if I wanted to get another set of smelter and constructor, I would have to make another generator. I have plenty of wires. I can just sit here and make cable. Oh, so for Christmas, I got a water cooler. <laughs> I'm that guy. I got a water cooler and a hydro flask. So, I'm going to say this every stream. Stay hydrated. Now let me see if I can... Dong. <laughs> oh, so good. And then I just need a couple iron, iron rods. And then we be we can begin the mining effort in earnest. Congratulations. You have unlocked building miner mark 1, building storage container, hub feature, additional biomass burner. Ooh, 10th objective. Complete hub upgrade 6. Note, there are no notes. Ooh! Okay. Connect. Oh no! We're okay. We're, we're okay. Right? I think this is gonna be fine. What's not going to be fine is how these fucking conveyor belts are going to be angled after a while. <laughs> oh no, I didn't notice, but they're not the same width. Eventually, I'm going to be doing like this semicircle sit thing if I keep building sideways. Okay, there's that. That and that. So we can connect this again to this, that to that, like so. Sent you a picture on Discord when you asked about the conveyor belts earlier. Oh no. <laughs> Oh no, my brain. So those are trekking along nicely, I guess. Okay. I have a question, I think. How come this is yellow? Is that a trick of the light? I don't know. It's not. This is... Oh, green means doing nothing. No, that means doing something. Does this mean doing nothing? That means doing nothing. Like yellow means it's not working, and green means it's doing stuff. Alright, well, sure, a resource node is clear of clutter before placing a miner. Multiple biomass burners can be connected to the same grid. What does it take to make a miner? I can already- Oh, that's adorable! It takes a portable miner to make a big miner! Oh no! 
Uh, this is this is fine, right? That's okay. I can tell. I have the best laid plans for this. Like, oh, it's gonna be nice. I'm gonna line everything up. It's gonna look beautiful. This one, me doing that, I can clearly tell I'm going to fuck this up royally. And very quickly, mind you. Oh no. I need an iron rod? I don't have any? At all? Okay, uh, can you put the power slug you picked up earlier into the bio generator? It's got power in its name. Good call. What did I even do? Oh, it's right there. Um, I have to wait until these burn out, I guess. Oh. I blew it. What did I do? That can't be good, right? <laughs> what did I do? <laughs> did I put too much on the same grid? You took the fuel out, but I can't put the fuel back. Can I? Oh, I can. All right. Oh no. Okay. We're gonna, gonna give that a minute. What if we... Let's take all of the stuff back. Okay. Let's try this again. I think because I have them on the same network. I think I have to split the networks here. I think this is a, um... Okay. Okay, I get this. This is fucking... Oxygen not included. They, ha they have a max thing per cable and stuff like that. Alright, we're gonna have to restructure that then. So this one can power this four, right? And then I can use this one as a separate. I just can't be on the same grid. Which means this needs its own grid. So I'd like to put that like right here or so. Can I attach that? I can! How is that even- I'm like clipping through- Wait, am I? Can't tell. To there. Oh no, my poor conveyor belt! I got distracted by everything shutting down! Oh no. Fuck, I need concrete. Everything sucks. Oh, like magic. He said the word. It's like saying the name of the uh, the movie in the movie. 
truly, this was our Final Fantasy XIV Endwalker <laughs> patch 6.0. Oh, this is so bad. I've seen some bad shit in my day. This is bad. All right, let's uh pick this up and make it even worse, shall we? I need plates. All right, so if I've got rods in one of them, I want plates in the other. So do these veins run out eventually? As I say that, you okay? What up, Shammy? Good evening. Uh, what's wrong with you? Nodes don't ever... Oh, I'm out of wood. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> oh, of course, I'm out of... No? What? You've made the mistake of having two separate power grids. I was tripping them off of one power grid. I had them all connected, and then it tripped. Well, that's not exactly two. I didn't... True, I didn't have them on one. I had... The two things connected here. This thing split off left and right. The left one was these two, the right one was these two, and that. And something tripped, and I couldn't fix it. And now, what seems straightforward, this leads to this, leads to that, is not working. So that did work before? Hold up. I'm telling you, this is just going to be a nightmare. So... Does it evenly split? Because they're both on this grid, right? So I've got both of these... Oh no. I don't like that max consumption. See, the whole thing tripped. It's because you have more machines than generators? This thing says, right? Its max capacity was 20. So these things each gen or each use four, four megawatts. So in that thing uses five, so I got 25 total. 
I don't think I need an extra generator because I have two that generate 20 each. So that should be 40 of power and then 25 in consumption. I, I don't need an extra generator. Something's weird here. Flip! Oh, slug. Uh, power slug does not go as fuel. I need to collect stuff. I'm going to eat every living thing on this planet. Okay. Because, yeah, if I connect the wire here, because this thing's generating 20, this thing, they're both connected to the same pole. Even if I split it, it's going to crap out. I can feel it right now. Hold on. Connect. It's the green. This has no thing going to it, so it shuts down. Yeah, there's no way I can do 100% grid. I have to split it. I have 800 hours in the game. You thousand or whatever percent have one grid. I think all right, then I need help. Me join help. No help. I need explanation. Why is this not working? They both generate 20, right? Capacity 20. Capacity 20. How do I increase the capacity if they both generate 20, but over 20 breaks me? Let me... All right, we'll, we'll try... We'll build a new one, because that's the one thing I haven't tried. I'll build. I'll build. Power. I don't know how to build. That one's on yellow means it's on standby, but it's not. I've got the power. It's connected. It's it should be giving power. And when I take it to that, it should be giving power. Not be dumb would be suck. Leaves. It's still the same. <laughs> the switch. Fasty 40. Okay. See? Alright, alright, alright. All right. Now I'm done. We are fixed though! Everything works! Blessed are we. I really need to move this thing. <laughs> how did it end up like this? I mean, I know how it ended up like this, but how did it end up like this? Let's Miner, I need plates. I should have plates, yes? Which one of you nerds did plates? You did. So how did the... I don't even know. How did this one even get turned off? That's the question. Did I accidentally do that without knowing? Let's build that. I'm going to deconstruct this. That seems appropriate. I'm going to... Yeah. And then I'm going to rebuild this boy. So can I connect two of these? No. What I can do is interesting weaves. Wait, what? Uh, overlapping clipping may occur. 
Is clipping bad? I mean, I know it's bad, but like... Yeah, There's blue here. Of course. This is exactly how it's supposed to be built. What does it mean clipping? What happens if clipping? I'm gonna clip. Clipping is aesthetics. Okay. So I can do it. The game will let me do it even if it breaks, like, reality? That's weird. Or not reality, but you know. Get to it, my weird conveyor belt. You can, uh, as you learn to grow, then you figure out how you want to place your factory. And many times you may rebuild as you learn to make it better. I'm interested to see this. We're gonna, we're gonna watch this lead one go in. Because we're gonna, oh, we can even pick it up off the conveyor belt. All right. I believe. We're gonna go surfing for a little bit. Yeah, it just clips right on through. <laughs> okay. No! <laughs> I'm out of fuel. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> Alien carapace. I'm sure I'm going to need that later. It eats 4.8 per minute? All right, we're going to go collect some... <gasps> Another blue slug. One of the bastards is going to kill me. Gonna, no, no, skirt, skirt on by you. Where'd you go? There you are. No idea what this is for, but we have two of them now, so that's cool. No! Hitarium ore? Never seen this shit. What's Hitarium? Oh, look at the weird little bird fella. He's just hanging out. Look at you. Yo, shit! Did he stop in front of the bird? Oh, shit! Come on, big boy! He's got speed lines. That's how you know he's going quick. Oh. But do you have to research it on the man? The Katarium? I don't know. No, no, no. Don't run. I like you. You're weird. Also, what... Is there a biomass other than leaves I should be looking for? Like, wood bad, yeah, all right. Leaves bad. But leaves plentiful. Also, look at this gorgeousness. Is this limestone? Fart! Leaves and wood, okay. Paleberry. Oh shit, the pale. That reminds me of Disco Elysium. God, that was fun. Raw quartz. Alright. Time to make some glass. I heard Disco Elysium. I have arrived. What up, Mesh? Yeah, I was just picking up some paleberry. And now I am ridding the world of leaves. How goes it? It is certainly going. 
my goo brain is rearing its ugly head in preparation for Baba is You at some point. Oh, look at my little baby! Little baby factory thing! It's adorable. Limestone, I don't care about. A solid biofuel. You are so lucky that you found this most valuable artifact. The Summer Sloop work in progress. Harvest it. Okay. <laughs> it definitely was not cursed, but yeah, I'll, I'll get there eventually. Don't you worry. This whole, all of these waterfalls will be consumed with the ravenous industry. Eventually. Unless this is Animal Crossing, and then I'll devise these giant plans, and then they won't come to fruition at all. And I'll give up on it, and put it away, and I'll never touch it again. We'll see. You know, life's interesting sometimes. You never know what you're gonna get. <laughs> and look at this boy! Oh. I assume you haven't touched Animal Crossing in weeks. You would assume correct. Another blue slug! So I think... What is that thing? I see the little charging fella. What's the other one? Be cool. Be cool. Be fucking cool. Once again, it costs you nothing to not do anything. It costs you nothing! Toro, motherfucker. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> oh, that was wonderful. Oh, another two. All right. We can play this game. Oh, shit. I want the berry. Give me the berry. Y'all want to go? Come on, bitch! Uh-oh. Bring it on, bitch. Oh, shit. He stopped on a dime! I don't know what that red thing is. There's so many weird things I see and I can't do anything about. I just don't want to die, bro. Oh, so if there's a uh, frame skipping and stuff like that in the stream, it's because it's loading chunks in game while I'm running around. So just be aware that I too am experiencing it, though I also have some rendering frame problems. So let's fill up these generators with leaves. I'm just stick some leaves in this shit. Once again, I forgot what I'm even attempting to build out here. Did I even know? Concrete and wires. Okay. Concrete's easy. You're building the future. In the future's future. In the future's future's future. If you haven't seen that, there was a uh, E3 Digital Devolver came out and did like a 10 minute video or something like that. Oh, it was wonderful. It was 2016, I think. 2016 E3. Sounds right. God, I love Digital Devolver. <laughs> They're so fucking weird. What? I don't have the limestone? Oh, shit. All right, what if I build a miner down there and just 
Okay, 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 we can do this. All right. I'm not happy about it, but we can do this, I think. I need a portable miner. I have to collect this motherfucker. Okay. Here's that. I guess we can do it on this side. That's not the worst idea I've ever had. Though it would just be a constructor. We don't need a smelter this time. I need two reinforced iron plates. <laughs> oh, it's limestone. I don't care about that right now. I didn't care about that right now. And I still, I care about that right now. Oh my God, my inventory is fucking shot. What is this thing? A strange alien thing with a mind bending and somehow familiar shape. Work in progress. Analyzing this will not give you anything. Very cool. Very cool. Okay, quartz processed into quartz crystals and silica. I don't know what the blue power slugs are supposed to do. I got cable. What else did I grab? There's one other thing, right? So, it was a... Cal... 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 This thing. Catarium. Used for advanced electronics. Right. Constructor. I will build a constructor next so that I don't have to build a ridiculous amount of... Stuff. And I need me to connect this shit. So I need another pole. Pole goes this way. Yeah, just just give it a second. That's a hell of a wire. All right. Put that switch and everything will be fine. Uh. Yeah? Just gonna clean the leaves out. Hey! hey. And I guess I can pipe it into a storage container, right? Because I have that now, right? Uh, storage container. Wait. Why does the storage container have an out? Construction is red, meaning you didn't select a recipe. Good call. I am going to do that <laughs> and literally do that. Oh no, what happened? What? How did that happen? No, 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 don't do this to me, bro. again oh, how did this happen <laughs> death button okay and that'll just go I never have to worry about that ever again in my life. Now, what I'm going to do with the storage container is... I don't know. I had a... Th 
thought process that I can narrow this down, right? If only I could have... I was thinking I have one smelter smelting out ingots, right? And then into a storage container, but the storage container ships ingots to like three different motherfucking constructors or something? That would have saved me a smelter, but I don't think you can do that. Though I am very clearly generating ingots faster than I am making rods. If you unlock the final upgrade, you get access to ways of solving that. Dope. That's what I'm looking for. All right, now I just need something for copper and uh, I'll be good to go at that point. Let's go collect the spoils of victory for this shit. I'm gonna need to make more. Oh wait, I don't need to make plates. Who needs to make plates? I need to collect plates. And next here. Oh, it's so nice. I'm going to kill you one day. You have unlocked building space elevator. What am I listening to? Biomass burner. Heart. Biomass. Motivational message. Congratulations. What are you? Succeeded in every provided task. On behalf of Fixit Incorporated, I thank you for your current and future service. Additional knowledge. The hub terminal has been converted to give access to milestones there to ensure you progress along Fixit approved protocols. Mm, yes. Note. Future developments should be aimed at constructing the space elevator and as such initiating project assembly. Good luck. Space elevator, huh? So what even is this thing? It just landed. Check your milestones now. <clears throat> Alright, we got tier one, we got tier two. I can base build, I can... So basically, tutorial over. Look at this shit. Foundations, ramps, basic walls, lookout towers. Oh, a splitter! Splits conveyor belt in three! <gasps> yes! <laughs> That's exactly what I'm fucking looking for! Now the question is... How do I get power... Oh, I get a biomass burner. Okay, okay. Because my copper is over the hill there. And I'd like to, you know, mine bring stuff over here? I'm not gonna sit here. <laughs> Fuck with copper like that. So just run a power cable up a hill. So I, I need to make another generator first. Biomass burner. Damn, this is a big boy compared to what's on the back of that bitch. Make a generator connected to the same grid and run a pole off the grid. All right. Sounds like a plan. It's already got four. Shit. Means I need a second pole here. You motherfucker! 
All right, we're back in business. Let's, uh... Need you? Past the... Oh, it's a little bit better than the ones in the back, too. All right. I'm into that. This has got two. I can connect a pole up here. Somewhere. Let me go that way. So as of now, I think I can only collect biomass. Like, I can't automate that as far as I can tell. So that'll be the next step. Is automating it so that the biomass... Iron ore. Shit. That's not what I want. Copper's on the other side. Cable, god damn it. <laughs> Is there fall damage? Cable, cable, cable. You should already be able to make better stuff from woods and leaves. Oh, really? Biomass. Oh. Oh. Okay, okay. So if I uh, shut down production of the generator. Ah, fuck it. I'll just let these ride until they die. So we currently got cables going. Let's cable it up. All right, cool. Though, when do I start harvesting coal? Shit, and oxygen not included? I rely on coal throughout, like, the entire game. Then again, I've never been good at making shit like, uh, self-propelled or self-powered oxygen machines, spalms or whatever. I always fuck them up in one way or the other. Ah, tier three, nice. I just want to pollute everything. Is that so wrong? I don't feel like that's wrong. Hopper's down there. Oh. I never pay attention to what- Oh, I should collect my copper. I'm gonna need it. You know, if you haven't played Sanctum, I realize Coffee Stain this is where they're at their peak. This type of shit. The first person, little floaty, like, alien planet thing. God, Sanctum was so good. That's, uh, Sanctum was Coffee Stain's first game, or whatever. I think. And it's a, uh, a tower def- a first person tower defense. So good. Love that game to death. All right. I really don't want to do that. So. It is time to make another constructor. It is not time to make <laughs> All right, screws first, then inventory management, then wires. Oh my God. I am devolving. All right, a couple wires. I can use the, no wait, I have to smelt the copper. So I do have to build another set. But I was going to end up building it anyway. So. So, smelter. 
All right, see, my problem is I want to line this up on the grid, right? But eventually, <laughs> the constructors are so thick that it's going to look like absolute ass. But I guess it's a future problem. All right, the iron plates are for the screws. have to get another power pole. Connect that to... That is full. Shit! <laughs> that one's full. That one's full. Uh, that one leads to that and that. Do they need to? Oh, God. All right, usually best to make use of the land to build copper factory at the copper site and shift product here rather than shipping ore and using up land here. My problem is that I wanted the generator here. Oh, wait, I still can. Oh. Okay, 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 I see what you mean. I get it, okay. Let's destroy that, destroy that. I need to get reinforced plates. Though, that's just for smelting. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, the reinforced plates. And I have the appropriate stuff to smelt, right? Yep. You can add stuff to shopping list. Oh. Add to-do list. Miner. Smelter. So I'm missing concrete. Ah <laughs> Yeah! Oh, beautiful! The constructor I'll build over here. I'm gonna smelt stuff over there, ship it this way, put it in a container, and then build the constructor here so that I don't have to go fetch it. I can just collect it here, stuff I need to build. Uh, no, 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 uh, concrete. So the constructor is not on my list of things to do over there. What are these? Old conveyor poles. All right. You should build stuff there and put container here with conveyor taking finished product to container. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. yeah. That's what I was doing. I was going to build uh, the miner and the smelter over here, ship it over there into a container at the factory or at the site. So this is just going to be like a owl smelter offsite thing. Though I'm not sure I needed to build two of them, but All right, that's a future problem. We'll circle back around to that. Yeah, the leaves. As I just mob a whole bunch of fucking fallen leaves. I needed to connect to the power grid. How far can we take these wires? Uh, small mouse movements. Wire too long. Put wire on old grid, then move wire. I think I can see. Wow, it was right on range, too. It was just out of range, I think. Yep. There. To 
right there. Why do I keep doing that? I mean, I know why. All right, the dream would be to have one smelter smelt double the ore, but I don't think I can handle that. I'd need some kind of super smelter. Don't you fucking do it. I heard something. Or a splitter? Yeah. Alternatively, I can just build two, but one would be better. For now. Use splitter to feed both into one smelter. The problem is that I haven't unlocked the splitter yet. That's back at the base. Check the output of a miner. Good point. Thirty ore per minute smelter is. Let's place it so I can see. Thirty per minute, so one per. So I would need two. Okay. We will do that then. I like that you can snap it to a grid like that, straight. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna build it on a rock! Okay, that means I need a second power pole for these two. I will put that here. This. To there. Shipping. Uh-oh. Flipping. Ow. What the fuck? I did it! Yeah, orange input! <laughs> yeah, orange input! Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you know, the worst part is that I do this in oxygen not included all the time, too. I... Something about it, just seeing the arrows fucks me up, and I don't know why. Like, I know I'm stupid, but boy, oh boy. Alright. So they are connected, and now it's just about... Feeding the finished product into a container. I would need the splitter to do that, so let's go see if I can skip garbage step. I gotta reinsert, you know, get the whole industry going again. Also, it'd be nice to get the foundation. That way, everything can be level, and I don't have to worry about fucking... Alright, which one of you nerds broke? You? Fifty. You broke too, huh? All right, I got biomass for you. Now, this begs the question, are there batteries? That way the excess energy that I'm using isn't lost, because that would be cool. Though I guess it's kind of small. It's not so important. Now, this building, I need plates and concrete. That's not the thing I'm looking for. Logistics. Oh my god! <laughs> nope. <laughs> I don't get no splitter, so I am going to build... Uh... Station storage container. 
here? The greatest spot in the world. I guess I could build it down here. Yeah, I'm hoping the progression will leave me satisfied. I could do this like a storage area down here. Well, now I want to move that shit over to here, too. Shit, I think I'll do that. That way I can just go to one little area and it'll finish that. So that begs the question, should I have a smelter in front of, of what's happening here? What's that capacity? I should feed them directly into a smelter, a smelter into a storage container, and the storage container off to the constructor. Because... I think a lot of this depends on me getting the splitter, right? That way I can take one storage container full of nothing but iron ingots and split it into different constructors. Ah, uh, don't bother with storage containers for ingots, only finished products. I just feel like, because right now I have two smelters for ingots, right? And they feed directly into the constructor, when instead I could have two of them feed to one storage container, and the storage container feeding to, like, three or four constructors. I don't know. But I guess that's just adding a step. I don't know, I was just thinking of making this the exact same way I'm making the shit over there. We'll see. Yeah, that's when I was just thinking about it. Just split the output from the smelter. That makes sense. I like the wreaths on the power poles. steep. That. That's why I suggested making wire and cables here and shipping that back to base and not the ingots. I was just thinking, because, like, constructors, do I want them doing one thing? I mean, I guess in the grand scheme of things, they do. Just automate, do the one thing forever, and that's your job. Suck it. I was just thinking of having all of my production stuff, like the constructors and stuff over by the base. But I guess this could just be like a fully remote thing. I need more cables. And no promotions. Do your job. Get on with it. Why did I build you? I have one sole purpose. It could be so much more, though. So, it's time to build some more containers. 
So do I build... I guess I can build them out here. I just want, like, a wall of fucking containers. You know, just line the, the whole goddamn... Oh, yeah. It's all coming together now. Oh, yeah. It's all coming together now. <laughs> Let's, uh, pipe that garbage there. Let's pipe that garbage there. A, what is it? Copper turns into wire and cable, correct? Iron cable, I think. Well, the wire turns into... Wait, why would I... Okay, okay, hold on. You have concrete on the go too? True, yep, concrete needs to be moved over here. Let me collect all this shit. Can I just... Yeah, it'll take it all with me. Beautiful. Let's fucking... Ship this bastard. Oh, you can do it at specific angles. I like that. <laughs> the fucking pole. <laughs> you know what? You're get no, you get moved. I need this. The aesthetics demand it. I don't want it in front of my biomass, so I think right about here. Can I go up with it? The clipping may occur, but I can go up with it. Hold on. This is going to be silly. Click the belt ones, then use the mouse wheel. <laughs> cool. Click on the ground and then lift. <gasps> what? <laughs> Yo! <laughs> oh, shit. Well, oh, this is going to be fun. Oh, how am I going to build this? I actually have no goddamn clue how to even start with this. Oh, I have no fucking clue where to even begin with this. I fucking love it. I wanna... No, I can't! Overlapping others clearance clipping may occur. Hold on. I wanna build it up here. Make it happen. Shit. Are they just letting me, like, build it? What the fuck? How come I can build it with so much clipping? Why are they letting me do that? <laughs> they allow clipping in new update 5 of Pure Savoida. Is that something I can turn off? Because honestly, I would like to not clip, honest. Like, function greater than form? Hell no! Form 
their fun yeah form is function in its purest essence it's beautiful I do want to kind of go over, though. And manually avoid going through machines. Oh, God. But there's going to be clipping all the time because of the wires. The wires. Oh, shit. Uh, the biomass balls. What? I don't have leaves? I do have leaves. Oh, it's in my storage. Oops. I put it in the storage like an idiot. Okay. I feel like that should be a toggleable thing, right? Just flip a switch in the settings and you no longer need to worry about the yellow. It doesn't even pop up as yellow. There is no yellow. Yellow is gone. Oh, that pole is sick. Okay, let's try this one more time. One more time. Let's get rid of that. Control to give it straight. Up you go. All right. Here's the hard part. Shit, that's not. Is there a limit to this? I was trying to click it to raise it up, but it wouldn't let me do that. Maybe it needs to be blue before I can do it. How am I gonna feed it over this bitch? I gotta, I gotta feed it through, because my constructors are gonna be here, like, piping hot sauce into this. Maybe I move the whole damn constructor set? Maybe I move the constructor down here. Oh. Wouldn't worry too much about straight, just now that you've unlocked base building, which keeps it all in grid. Why are you going that way and not behind minor? See, and this is why I need to stream this for chat. Chat helps me. You know, it's a little give and take here. I don't need that anymore. I don't need that anymore. container right here. And we're in. See, this is why I need you guys. I need you here. Because going behind the miner didn't even fucking... I didn't even consider it. Though, I feel like I'm gonna need to do something here about the, uh, lackadaisical process of these iron rods. A 
because boy, oh boy, they take a while. So that goes there, that goes there. Concrete will be here eventually. Uh, what do I have? I have iron in my inventory somewhere? Yeah. Alright, I mostly have copper. Got some biomass and I'm gonna slap down. Alright, and that looks like it's trucking along nicely. So all of that is good. Now it's just about feeding the appropriate copper conveyor belts over here and getting that section started appropriately. Because I need a fuck ton of wires, right? I just need an obscene amount of wires. Yeah. An obscene amount of wires. So it's going to be about having both of them make wires, feed it into these, merge them eventually, and feel good about life. So the question is, do I do build two more down here? I think I do. I might need to change this up just, just a little bit. Hold on. Hold that thought. Feed along the side of this, and then feed into the garbage. Close enough. Doesn't need to be perfect. Alright, select the big orange button to select milestone and it tracks what you need. Select the big orange button next. Okay. I will do that. Because really, all I know, well, I say all I know. The, the important thing right now is that I know I need copper. And that is a very step-by-step -step process. Hmm. So to get a cable or whatever, you'd have to have two constructors because you have to construct the wire and then construct the cable from the wire. So that's interesting. Shit, I keep clicking the wrong button. Instructor. Oh my god, I need We're gonna have to do a little bit by hand. Just a little bit. Because I need the, the wire and cables, so I'm going to make like 40 of each or something. Come back here. Constructors also need the re reinforced plates, so I need to make screws. So screws come from the plates. Which plates are coming from this? They're feeding into that storage thing, so I would have to feed this storage container into another- No. Because I need the plates for certain things, too. Hmm. So what's the best way to go about doing that? Because I need the plates, so feeding them into the storage container is kind of good. But I need to use the plate- Or no, it's the rods. The rods to make the screws. Should I just do that manually whenever I need them? Probably not, right? Oh, that's my reinforced plate. Right, 
One, two, three. A whole bunch of wires. <clears throat> so split her off the rods, or better yet, use the iron, other iron nodes in the area to make screw factory. Oh, that's true. You could just dedicate one of the mining operations to screws themselves. I do have, there's like six nodes here. The scale at which this is ramping up is staggering to me, honestly. <laughs> Because I to do that, I would have to make another generator, I'd put it back on the grid, slap it over there. Develop a whole different thing, slap, you know, the, the smelter, the two constructors that I need, move, and then feed it all the way back into a container over here. <laughs> the scale at which this is progressing is scary. So let's go build the uh, copper shit, because that's the most important thing. I'll worry about screws later. I can do that by hand, at least. The copper thing. 500 wire is too many. Select your milestone. No, I'll be all right. I'm already on my way out, though. You are right. I should have. I just know I need copper. That's, that's important thing number one. Get the copper shit up and going, and then I can worry about stuff. Because I need to do the same thing with uh, the wire here. I've got to have a constructor feed into a constructor. And then just one constructor over here. Floor is too steep. Oh, shit. Doesn't feed. Did I, th did I build them right? I did. Don't tell me the one is too steep and this one's not like that's okay motherfucker this is where base building helps Feed. it's there Build one more pole. Feeds into the pole. The pole feeds into these garbage. And then it's about building a conveyor belt to go into the garbage containers on the other side of the world. Let me get them side by side so I don't have to... Can't afford! I need plates! <laughs> oh, dick! All right, cable, wire, concrete, rod, plate. At least my brain recognizes what's where. That's good. All right, what do we got, what do we get? Oh no, the poor boys. So I've actually worked a job where I had to pick up these fucking cable pallet things. They are not fun to work with. Uh oh, there's going to be clipping. I don't want clipping. It didn't say there would be clipping, though. Maybe there won't be clipping. 
No, there will definitely be clipping. Well, maybe it's okay if I do it like this. Alright, how does one remove tree? Tree must be removed. Look up close. They've done a remarkably good job with the graphics. Oh God. Is it really that on point? Not when my textures are set so low. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, there we go. Oh, uh, it wants to. There it goes. <laughs> I need to feed them under the wire. So that to get them side by side. Oh no. At Ultra they have labels and stuff. That's pretty cool. A player is in the way. Oh no! Alright. Realistically, I kind of want to build out and then in and meet in the middle here. Oh no! Dude, it lets it doesn't even say there's clipping. Check your logistics before you build. Uh logistics? What you mean? Shit. Keeps leaving the pole and I forget about it. In the build menu, I have conveyor belt one and pole. Yeah, I gotta wait when I'm set here. It's just shit. Shit, there's gotta be a way I can make this work. Damn it. And make a switchback? What's a switchback? Outside of a sweet, uh. Cell Dweller song. There's an easy way, but it requires an extra thing. Shit. Damn it, I want it up here so bad! Hold on, what if I... That's not okay that they let me do this. That's not okay! Check your wire, you may have enough to unlock thing. I'd have to like scoop it all off the conveyor conveyor belt. Hold on. <laughs> We're gonna run this bitch. One at a time, baby. Oh, uh, is it? No, it's two at a time. I got 214.
definitely getting there. Though I've noticed you can't, you have to like look down to pick them up, so that's something. I was wondering why I was missing someone. I'm spamming E. Gotta look down. Oh no, it's one at a time. Okay. Two sixty-seven. Check the milestones. You see what the thing is. All right. I'll head back, check the milestones out, and then hopefully we'll have enough wire by that point. Yeah, is there some kind of terrain deformer? I need to deform the terrain. It's important. This is conveyor lift! Neat. Yep, still need... Oh, we're actually... I thought it was 500, it's 300. Uh, what was the thing? Click the orange, select. When do I get a jetpack? When do I get the terrain remodeler? I have so many questions. Also, why does this guy turn purple something? So many questions. All right, 300 is what I'm looking for. Don't fuck me. Yes! Let's get the fuck out of here. gonna collect some cable while I'm here. Oop. And that's how you avoid fall damage. Plates, rods. I have to wait reach. four minutes? Conveyor belts can now merge, split, and lift to increase the complexity and efficiency of your factory. Oh, before I can we do another milestone. We to consider okay, more verticality when it comes to factory logistics to streamline short-range transportation. The productivity display will help you measure and improve the productivity of individual buildings to aid with optimization. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, four minutes, do another milestone. That sounds... That's fun. You're not gonna see me <laughs> blitzing through milestones. I promise you that. Q, bear lift. <gasps> Shit! I bet. I need a human elevator, too. Where's that at? Click it onto output of storage. That is the correct play, yes. I can do that all from up here, which is what I'm... That's the goal. Here. Here. Uh. Neat. Oh. oh, okay, hold on. I'm learning a thing here. Yeah, drag it and then lift it. All right. Oh, fantastic. go with no clipping there wait did I they need to be connected nope they do not need to be connected at the bottom that's cool and 
here. In parallel. Now the question is, will this be able to hook around without a stilt of some kind? And the answer is yes. Oh, feels good, man. Awesome. Oh, that's nice. Hold on, I need to blow out my candle. It's been going for... I've been playing this for two and a half hours. Hey, what time is it? 3.30, oh god. Okay, uh... I was intending to play a little bit of Sekiro today, but I'm pretty sure that's not gonna happen. So... My bad. So much better than trying to belt it up a slope. Yeah, I would say so, shit. So now this bet. Oh, yeah, my power's down. Milestone Oops. exchange concluded. Fix it, freighter re entry complete. Did I just. No, I need to buy a mask. Okay. So that motherfucker's actually out. That is not a lot. And we're actually... Okay, that, that's more appropriate. 65 max on the grid. Not ideal, but... So... My leaves... The limestone I'm gonna put in the smelter. Flower petals. Alien carapace goes in there. Alright, check out the other milestones, see what you, what you wanna get next. The other two, there's two that will probably sound more attractive. So I got base building. I like the idea of getting foundations. The lookout tower I don't necessarily need because I got that ledge there. Ma'am, molecular analysis machine is used to analyze new and exotic materials found on alien planets. R&D will assist pioneers through the Ma'am to turn on or turn any valuable data into usable research options. Well, that's next. Yeah, that's tier two is available too. True. Simpler jump pads used for quick. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> Be sure to land safely. Resource sink. Got excess resources? Fear not, for fix it does not waste. The newly developed awesome sink turns any usable part straight into research data. I don't know what research data is. Um, we're going to do the MAM and the object scanner. That seems right. So, for that, I need... Way more wire, more screws. Time to build the screw facility, which means we need another generator, by the way. Which means I need more biomass. Obstacle clearing would be very cool. But the man, was that on the man thing? I wasn't even paying attention. I just saw ma'am and was like, yeah, that sounds good. Object scanner. No, that was in tier two. Obstacle clearing. Chainsaw! Oh shit! <laughs> cool. Solid biofuel, I see. The most energy efficient form of solid biomass can be used as fuel for the chainsaw. Okay, absolutely 100%. It's going to be the field research here so that. I don't know. They both need screws. Oh, you're right. It's probably better to do obstacle clearing. That solid biofuel is going to be. Quite useful. All right, so it's the same thing. I still need to build a second generator so that I can build the screw factory. Copperfield. 
luckily we have copper for that. Then I have to rewire everything. <laughs> oh God, I have to rewire everything. All right, that's my cables, I need copper. Oh God, here we fucking go. This is gonna be the problem. Since these cables can, well, I could attach it here. So that's only at three, right? That seems okay. It'll work for now. That's all I need. I just need it to work for now. Okay. Oh, wait, no. I need a, di a different pole. We'll pole here. And I need that pole to connect to that pole in a really stupid, bizarre fashion, but whatever. If that connects it to the grid, that splits this off, we're fine. Just very odd how that looks. Then I will need another pole here. That boy? Production miner. Well. Oh, I need plates. That's fine. I feel like maybe I should raise these things up at some point. 200 plates. Grab 200 of those since I'm not using them. What is this? Limestone. I should go slap that in the concrete thing. But that way I'm not jumping over everything. I can just walk under all the conveyor belts. Seems appropriate. Though boy, when I get foundations, this whole belt, all of this is getting leveled. All of it. Exactly do it. So I can build it here and curve around. Force it over here, feed it over top of everything down there. Alright, that seems good. You have two nodes, so I could have both doing screws. That is seems excessive. And there might be something I learned to do with iron later, but then again, I guess I could change it whenever I would need. All right, feed straight into that. I need two constructors, which means I need four reinforced iron plates. Or screws, nothing is excessive. I guess that's true. I am probably undervaluing screws a little bit. You know, or I could just hit, I could just hold space forever. How's that, huh? Is that riveting gameplay y'all like? Hold space forever? Don't hold space. Oh no, is there, is there a better option I should be doing? Tap space to autocraft. Oh shit! Okay! <laughs> Damn, the more you know. Yes, significantly better, thank you. The m I would have never figured that shit out. I would have been holding space to the day I goddamn die. 
Oh, significantly better. Oh, shit. That's a game changer. That's what that is. All right. All right, feed a constructor. Do a constructor. Garbage in between everything. Son of a bitch. How did you do that? Alright, like that, and then like that. Alright, uh, before they added that, people would put their phones on spacebar. Wow. I mean, it makes sense. You, got, you have a lot of stuff to do. All the time. Oh, I guess it doesn't... I can get it powered and get it started now. Hold up. I gotta go collect some more. I have to do. I have to do. Whoa. Why does that look so weird? What did I do? No, fuck it. I gotta go collect stuff. Yeah, give me them flower petals. The reason I was going on about Sanctum so much earlier is that this soundtrack is very Sanctum to me. I'd not bother with the flowers cannot be made into biomass. I was just going to use them temporarily as that. Sure, a little wasteful, but... Oh, I have to make another pole anyway. Son of a bitch. Whatever, I don't care about clipping on wires. Wires can go fuck themselves. Okay, iron ingots in two. Iron rods. This is gonna log jam so bad. Should I have a split here? It's gonna log jam, because I make 30 of these, right? It's 30 ingots per minute. 30 ore to 30 ingots into 15 rods. So that's half the rate. I could technically funnel two. Oh, I can funnel two. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I could double that. Yeah. Okay. Let's, let's take a moment. Let's, let's take a fucking moment. What's the problem here? Oh, that's the problem. Get rid of that first. Splitter. Can I not just connect it? I guess I can't, huh? So that means I need another goddamn pole. <laughs> oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it so much. 
I guess. It just... I... The aesthetics were ruined there. Okay. That means I need four construction. Good thing I built all of those extra goddamn... This is a learning process for me. Uh, let's see. When pull upgrade for more than four connections. Yeah. Snapping without foundations is a right royal pain. Yeah, that's why I was saying all of this is getting completely destroyed when I get foundations. I'm just gonna level the whole base and restart from scratch. Outside of the containers, obviously. What did I need? Convict. Get fucking tension. Cable. Wait, I have cable. No, I need cable. Okay. Whoop. That. I'm just gonna restock and get a whole. Get all that wire. And it all just stacks together so nice and neat. Put the constructors side by side, so split into side by side constructors. Okay. Yeah, that's a good idea. Stab! Yeah, 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 yeah. Pole? Out of here, Pole! No one likes you! Alright, so that feeds that. It's gonna to need to feed... That as well. That's three connections, so I need to feed into another pole. All right? I need two different poles here. I need one pole for these two nerds, and I need another pole for the other two nerds. It doesn't need to be pretty, it just needs to be done. Alright, so that feeds into that, this feeds into that. Feeds into that. Rods. Make screws. Rods. Make screws. I can probably merge them because they're not going to be at the full rate of 30 things a minute. They're going to be every other, I think. So they could probably merge together into one conveyor belt into one container, I would assume. Yep. So let me get this shithole started back up. Logistics, a merger. Whoa! <laughs> 
It's beautiful. <laughs> right now, I need to stop doing that. What the fuck? Oh, did you really build down there? All right. I have both of these cross over. aesthetics in me demands it demands to do it right better not great but better now can I not lift this up why can't oh, motherfucker What's the problem? Floor too steep? What the? What do you mean floor too steep? I want to put it right there. Fuck me, whatever. Alright, this one's just gonna have to be freeform. This is the price we pay. So making a horizontal conveyor and snap the merger onto the belt would work neatly. Well, that's what I tried. Like, I had this, and then I tried, and then it was like, conveyor too garbage. Or, uh, sorry, floor too steep. Because I wanted to put the stupid thing at the end of this. It ain't work. You tried it at the end, not into the belt. Oh, alright. Try that. The clipping is real. All right, make the belt longer, put a merger on it. Okay, okay. So, right here. Put the merger on it. I know, bud. I know, shit sucks. All right, now it's just about making it aesthetic. Uh, 
uh, or use a lift. Then you can get better height. Lift on container, lift on constructor, and nothing on ground. Well, that's kind of what I was going to do to begin with. You are correct. That would be... Hmm. Instead of having the two like this. Yeah, uh, we could get some more height on it. I was thinking no height. Or, you know, this is an appropriate height. But maybe lifting it up first from the conveyor or from the constructor is okay. Let me go see where I'm slapping this thing and work my way backwards. That makes way more sense. aim location hold up we, this is how we do it I can actually do it from here what do you mean clipping it's not gonna clip there it's beautiful there's no clipping now we have a problem here I'm gonna cut slap it over I mean, this is a lot of stupidity just for me to have some some stupid fun. Doing shit like this. Oh, no. Yeah, fuck it. It can stay. <laughs> Hold on. I'm not done yet. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Clips. All right, so shit. I could put it down here. Oh, it's genius. Oh yes, I am into this. Aerial screw package. Oh, I am so into this. Hold on. Air lift here. Oh, <laughs> you can make the boy tall. That's great. How do I get up there? Oh God, I made him two different heights. Please send help. That, 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 that one correct? That one correct. I can't tell. That one correct. No, 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 I connect. No, 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 no. This one first. Next like that. And then, uh, the merger. Yeah, 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 this is dumb as shit and I love it. Oh, this is dumb as shit and I love it. Oh, that's the dumbest looking thing I've ever seen. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's gorgeous. All right, I'm gonna let that ride. I gotta, I gotta go collect some biomass. Oh, it's gorgeous. Lift was rather high, but the concept is good. I know. That's why I love it. I made it way too high. I'll fix it later. As of right now, I'm very satisfied with the way that how stupid it is. <laughs> He's all wrong, but the enthusiasm's there. Oh, God. 
You're satisfactory. <gasps> Fuck, son. The, uh... It's getting a little worse. The lag I'm getting when it's loading a landmass. Oh! Just gotta make the lift go all the way up to the skybox and then another one to go all the way back down. <laughs> oh, if only. It's genius. I should. I gotta do that at some point. You gotta get obscene with it. Like, not even weird. You gotta get fucking obscene with it. You know how many screws I need? I need so many screws. Holy shit. And leaves? You know how many leaves I need? So many leaves. Okay. I just thought about it. So all of that was for one node of screws. I have a second node I could do right here. Have you seen Let's Game It Out, aka Josh? I think I saw one video of his a while ago. Something about launching, using the conveyors to launch himself at like mock speed or something. That was a while ago though. That's who I keep referencing? Yeah. He specializes in trying out stupid shit. I feel like if you're gonna play this kind of game, it's not that you're... It's not that you want to, but I feel like you're obligated to try out stupid shit. Just at any and every opportunity. Why wouldn't you, right? So I may have been incorrect about the uh, the speed at which we accrue screw. But this is fine. Then there are others that go for beauty. That's true. But I don't know. I feel like the absurdity the game, this kind of game lends itself to absurdity. I, obviously, like I've mentioned before, I get my... I get my foundation. I want it to look good in uniform, right? Like, I don't want to be building on dirt and grass and have rocks clip and shit like that. I would want it to look aesthetically pleasing. I got two more iron ore over here. Oh, God. What up, bird? Come here. No, 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 no. What, are you a chicken? Bruh. You don't even go very fast. What the shit was that? What is this? I like weird stuff zip zooming. God. All right, we're gonna get some um, some lag spikes on the video. It is inevitable because I'm going to be loading some new chunks. Because while this goes, because I need so many damn screws, I'm just gonna go explore. I want to see what the hell all that is, so I'm gonna go that way. There's a great video from Fluxo, Sat uh, Satisfactory Update Five, Entire World Showcase. Oh, you're. I think you can link stuff here. Um. I don't think I have links turned off. But if it's the, uh, the whole, like... When I was perusing whether I should buy this or Factorio, I kind of learned that this is all one... They give you four options at the start, right? Do you want to start in snow? Do you want to start in desert? Do you want to start in grasslands? 
and I learned it's all the same map, just different spawn points. Which means this map is fucking huge. That was a bad pun, but I refuse to apologize. Looks like Link's work. I added uh, Link's Awakening, the Switch, onto the list of upcoming games in no particular order. Whether that happens before Final Fantasy is unknowable. I want to be there. That's a bit steep, bro. Especially with all the other games I got. And Final Fantasy has already gotten fucking pushed and pushed and pushed and pushed. I owe you channel points since you can't change character names in five. Oh, really? Butts is always butts? Poor bastard. What is all this? So, I have been walking this long, and that cool area that I want to be at is over there. Can I just, like, double click that? I can. Well, that was a waste of a thing, but... Ah, the pale berry. I'm just gonna continue to collect leaves. That's biomass. I'm gonna need them when I get back. Everything's gonna shut down soon anyway. So we got more of these lanky fellas. A waterfall? How dangerous do you think it is to jump in this raging-ass river? You can change his, but you spent points to change another. Oh. No, that's good. I got points galore, dog. <laughs> I want to go explore, but I'm obligated to return now. Where's my, uh, my teleport function? I am very far from the hub. You had the most points crewed this year? Oh, yeah! I couldn't tell you who did in my channel because I wasn't signed up to get marketing emails. <laughs> Bro, I've got so many goddamn leaves. It's odd to me that Twitch decided if you're not signed up for Mark, and it, it's not even like a post thing, you know? It wasn't the case where like, oh, you can sign up for your marketing emails now and we'll send you the thing. No, you had to have it done prior to them sending the email because there's no way you can get the email after they sent it or attempted to. That critter just told you to leave? A very, um... Poignant about it, not poignant, um, coercive. Okay. We have plenty of leaves, at least. Uh, Twitch doing something half-assed? This is my shocked face.
It's just a shame. It's always a goddamn shame. Also, my screws are still going strong. Thank you. Do I just wait until they're done? Oh, they are done. Look at that. Let me wait until they filter before I turn power back on. Well, I need to anyway, because I mess. Oh, yeah. Oh, this begs the question when I'm going to get to Sekiro. Lord fucking knows. And this is your second reminder. Stay hydrated, boys. Y'all got any plans for the New Year's? Y'all got your resolution set? Huh? My resolution this year totally went by the wayside. <laughs> that's mostly because of the computer shit the bed. That's not true. It's mostly because I'm a lazy piece of shit. But that's neither here nor there. And just remember, they say... My resolution will still be 1080p. My brother. Who needs those 1440s? Who needs 120 hertz? I don't need that shit. Uh, I'm out of space. Interesting. What was I saying? I don't even fucking remember. Oh, my screws are good. Turn this bitch back on. Why would anyone want more hertz? That's a good question. Yes, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this. Oh God, no, I'm gonna be here forever. I have so much ore, though. Your resolution went by the wayside. It did. Uh, no, I'm just I'm just garbage at it, and I don't have anything lined up for the year. But they do say there there's a myth that says whatever you're doing at midnight, come the new year, will be what you're doing. You it'll. How do I how do I I don't know how to word it. It paves the way for what you'll be doing the rest of the year. So if you're hanging out with friends, you're going to have a good, you know, hang out with friends. It's going to be your year, you know? That's an old, an old superstition. I could have just been instead of complaining. Ah, oh, shit. I was asleep last year. Ah, the old man. Did you have a good sleep year? I play at 65 inch 4K TV. Oh no. <laughs> Hell no on the sleep. So you shouldn't be playing, or I shouldn't be playing League at Midnight. Uh, well, I mean, if in that's what you want to do, sure. More power to you, friend. Would I recommend it? Probably not. Twenty twenty two gonna be a salty year, boys and girls. You can choose not to. Check this out. Oh wait, that's actually Oh no, both of them are full? Uh. Hmm. That just invites someone happening to tell you to. S uh, you, you suck, uninstall at midnight. And then, boom, at midnight you can uninstall it and be like, League free forever, boys. Now's the time. Now could be the time. I don't know what to do with this copper and shit. 
I got copper, I got iron, I got copper, I got copper, I got copper. Limestone needs to go over here. It's my secret. I have chat turned off. This is full. The limestone. I, I have. I'm overproducing on base materials. Which means I can do another constructor here if I wanted more concrete. I'll figure that shit out later. I want to progress instead of continuing to, to redo the base. You know limestone is why sinkholes exist? Complete the milestone, yes. I'm almost there. I just, I should go see how many screws we got. Cause I'm sure we have plenty. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's all coming together, boys. Oh yeah. You can put, oh, you can, I thought you needed to progress it all at once. I didn't know you could just slap it in there, that's cool. Milestone reach. Biofuel will ensure maximum efficiency of biomass burners. To aid in biofuel production, you are now capable of removing foliage that consists primarily of wood. Additionally, R&D inflated your pocket dimension. Ah, yes, the pocket dimension, of course. So, I can make solid biofuel now, and to make solid biofuel, I need biomass. I'm gonna shut this bitch down. Wait, no, I have tons of fucking biomass. I just went on a whole ass excursion. I don't need to shut it down. Oh god, it takes forever. Oh yeah, the chainsaw. Oh, I can go cut that tree down that's clipping into my... Clipping into my... Uh, conveyor belt. Thank you. Also, how, how, do, how does limestone create sinkholes? What, what's the logistics mesh? Wood into biomass, leaves into biomass, merge both into, uh, yeah. Biofuel. Limestone dissolves in water. So that must have been what they were using on that toy. I was, I was telling you before that the nieces and nephews got these little, like, toys that they had to dig at a, at a limestone. I guess it's limestone. They'd give them little plastic toys and they'd have to scrape at it to try to get, you know, to archaeology it out. Underground water removes limestone, leaving holes so it erodes away and then the ground collapses. See, that's not my problem. I'm not doing anything. I'm removing the limestone from the environment so that no holes may be created outside of the controlled ones I'm already making. Or do you hate concrete, huh? You a concrete hater? Is there a faster way to do this? <gasps> Wait a second, there probably is! I can do a fucking... Oh, yeah, he's back. I can make a constructor. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun. But the question is, how do I... How do I automate making biofuel or biomass? Do I just collect leaves myself, slap them in a container, have the container shipped to a constructor, have that constructor shipped to another constructor? Fill one crate with leaves, one with wood? Okay. So that means I need them out here. 
Or maybe a separate set of constructors? Can storage? Maybe. So let me think. One with wood, one with leaves. They both turn in the biomass. The biomass then ships into another constructor. So a merge. Okay, so three constructors in total, right? Okay, one, two, three, ship it out. Have a container for each thing here. I would do it the other way. I, think. I would have the ship go that way. Merge here. Why are you floating? What have you done? What have you done? No, <laughs> you motherfucker, what have you done? Fine! It doesn't have to be perfect! I no longer care! Go eat ass! Shit, I need screws! <laughs> it's that little- is there a little pebble right on the corner? I don't see a fucking pebble. I'm about to get stuck. No, oh, thank you. Uh, screws. This one. Hold on. Let me, let me delete. Oh, it's this thing. Can I chainsaw this bitch? Whatever. I'm upset about it. I'm allowed to be upset. I'm just going to continue to be upset and be okay with that. God, this... Everything here looks like complete ass. So I'm thinking... At four at a time, I feel like one constructor of... Biofuel will likely not be enough. Right? Like... One is plenty? I don't know, it just seems weird. One like that. <laughs> oh, it's like pulling teeth sometimes. I gotta re-up. I gotta re-up. I think we're good on that, actually. How many wires we got? That's concrete. Hold on. We all, like 500 concrete now. How many wires we got? I'll take the 112. Oh, shit. Get that three back. What about the cables? How are we looking on those? All right. So this was my fear. These thick boys. I have to spin them. Whoa, wrong buttons. These two need to be backwards. This was my fear. It's getting weirder and weirder. 
as it gets longer because these constructors are so thick. So they're just getting more and more offset. <laughs> this is not a good look. Okay, did that. Logistics, a merger. Okay, biomass, left to right, no, this should be wood then. And this will be leaves. Do I have leaves on me? Yes. Ship that out. And then, solid biofuel. 200 in there, because why not? And then ship it to a container! <laughs> oh, okay, I thought I fucked it up. I wonder if you can have the biofuel auto-feed into the generator, or maybe that, that'll be cool. That's what I'm thinking. Like, there'll be... I'll be able to dig up coal, mine it, or, you know, ship it into a container or something like that, ship it into the generator, and the generator will use it as it needs. Completely automated. The biomass is probably just this. Oh, I need the power of these motherfuckers. All right. Uh, it's three out of four. Technically, I think I only need the one. But am I about to shit the whole system down? How much you make? Oh! Oh, that's lovely. 60 a minute? Oh, that's lovely. I thought that was going to progress at a much slower rate. Okay. Uh, that's got that problem solved. Uh, I have the materials to launch this thing. I'm just going to launch it. Milestone reached. The molecular analysis machine, referred to as the MAM, will allow R&D to provide new technologies, items, and buildings based on samples collected in the field. To ensure a greater chance of success during exploration, <laughs> an upgraded tool belt has been provided, as well as an object scanner and beacons. Note, the object scanner requires calibration via the MAM to enable detection of specific objects. The hub, the map. And to make the space elevator, that's actually not far off. It's just a ton of material, but it's all material I can make, so that's not bad. Okay, what the fuck is a map? Uh, I have little to no idea of where to put this. I think I'm putting it here. Doesn't have to be pretty, it just needs to work for now. It can be pretty later. All right, so how does this work? Have you got containers to dump your leaves and wood into? So you do a run drop off of leaves and woods and it just does its thing? Yeah, that's uh, I took two of the containers on that, that side. Way over here. The right one is leaves. So this one is leaves and that one is wood. They'll feed into these, they'll spit out biomass, they merge together, 
and then feed into that garbage. Of which I are you done? Shit. Yeah. Now I need to figure out how this works and what it even is. <gasps> power slugs! I get a power shard? I gotta go collect my slug. Oh, it's back. <laughs> what the shit is happening? The analysis of blue power slugs is completed. Please choose a new node in the tree. New recipe unlocked. What is this? New research available in the MAM. Overclocking? Stick your spare biomass in the output of the first constructors too and it will push the biofuel generator. I didn't even know you could do that. That's dope. Uh, should I... Probably middle one, right? But that's, that's steep. Slug scanning. What do I do with the, the thing that I got? I like, what, what is this power shirt? I don't see it in my inventory. Works. Oh, a nutritional New mixture. Object added to the object scanner. Oh, oh god. I have not found bacon agaric. A <laughs> bacon mushroom? Alright. Terium, I have some of that. Cool. Alien carapace. Okay, so let me grab my quartz, my caterium, and the carapace, I guess. Quartz. Oh no. I didn't get that. Oh, there it is. Caterium, carapace. Towards biomass? What? Oh, that I can turn the carapace into biomass. I'm sure. Okay. So that means I can make... I get it. I can use the blue power slug to make a power shard now. I'll let that ride. So what is a power shard? It radiates a strange power. Uh... Not entirely sure what to do with that, but we'll figure it out. Stuff I have to go re up on my screws and my wires and my plates. Right. Oh, we got so many screws. Alright, so that's... There's my iron plates. Do I have anything else I need to re-up? Oh, let me put the biomass in here. Nice! So this is going along swimmingly. 
at some point... I guess that's what the Katarium and the Quartz is for. Let's see, there, there's some more stuff. It's like research on top of research on top of research. It's crazy. Milestone reached. Here's my foundation. It's time to level everything. Aim to provide the first needed to build basic factory infrastructure and improved overview. Building these will provide a grid for more advanced organizing and sectioning of your factory. Oh no. I don't think I'm gonna be doing this on stream. I'm not. Now you can start making the factory look nice. I mean, I guess I could. It depends on how long. I intend to stream it if I want to do this now. <laughs> I really would. I'd have to scrap it all. Lay down the foundations initially. And then rebuild it back up. Oh, God. Okay, okay. Let me see what else. Nice thing is that you get 100% of your materials back, so you never waste something. Thank God. Craft two parts into another part. Can be automated by feeding parts into it with conveyor belt connected to the input. The produced parts can be automatically extracted by connecting a conveyor belt to the output. What does that mean? So you remember that part about me saying this reminds me, <laughs> reminds me of Subnautica? I remember launching into space. That was nice. Apparently I need this. I have all of it. Let's see, 200 of that. 200 of that. Whole bunch of that. And a whole bunch of that. Oh, navigating this place is a bitch. Milestone reached. More complex assembly of parts can now be automated. Project assembly parts can now be constructed and sent up via the space elevator. Note, project parts are too complex to produce by hand. So, now I have an assembler. I need to, I have rotors, okay. Rotor is a thing I can make. Okay. This is where having storage like that is so satisfying. Oh yeah. I can tell, I mean, it's basic common knowledge. I say common knowledge, it's not necessarily common or knowledge in general. But when I was playing Oxygen Not Included, it helped a lot, a lot to have storage in one specific area. Okay, okay. So. It's time to make the transition. No, it is not. That is crazy. That is crazy. I was going to switch everything to biofuel, but... Okay, what about this one? Got. I keep fat fingering stuff. Four per minute. Oh, snap. That's a lot of minutes. Did you build the chainsaw? Nope, good call. Thank you. I 
forgot about the chainsaw. Where the fuck do I build a chainsaw? Oh, the equipment! I completely forgot about this thing! Oh, yeah! What is this? A beacon? Okay, okay, so I need, uh, I gotta go re-up on my stuffs. Let me duck under that real quick. I think when I go to rebuild everything, I'm gonna lift the conveyor belts up on basically everything so that I can walk freely under them. Uh, run and press crouch. Is, oh my God, is there a slide? Yes. Uh, I need the re-up wire. Woo! <laughs> yes! It's Call of Duty all over again. God bless. Oh, equipment. All right, I need three of these for one object scanner. Okay, chainsaw requires uh, reinforced iron plating. Okay. Work for that. Chainsaw acquired. Uh, how does this work? What am I scanning? Oh, at the bottom left. Scanning for berries, scanning for nut. Alright. Chainsaw. Yeah, boy! Uh, slug analysis concluded. So I can now scan for quartz. Scan for no quartz crystals. Okay. New resource added to the resource scanner. All right. So I need to go find quartz and nuts and caterium. And I have a tree to murder. Uh oh. <laughs> How the fuck did I. I haven't left my base in years. Overclock is amazing. Definitely 1000% research overclock. Alright. I gotta go chop a tree though. Hold on. Look at this. It's glorious. Look at this. Absolutely fantastic. Where is that shit ass tree? <laughs> Oh, you're on the sh ooh, ooh yes! <laughs> oh, I have power. I need something else to chop. I gotta chop him up. Serve him with the linguini. Al dente. You know there are some. What is this? That's one of those spitter fellas. Uh, look, I I'll be cool. You be cool. Hey, close. Stop. I strongly advise you to harvest this specimen. Ooh. Comply. Who 
was just talking to me. You're running past loads of trees. I have specific things. Like this Mercer Sphere. Work in progress. News from Earth. Widespread chaos and mayhem. World President urges all citizens to do their part and harvest alien artifacts. Hmm. Hmm? Where's my zoom? Harvest. All right. B. What you doing there, big boy? Everything else is moving. What you do? Oh, I see a yellow slug thing. I want to go collect it. But no, I'm looking for weird trees. Like, yeah, like that thing. Like, what the fuck is going on over there? What is all this? I remember I don't want to be near it. It's bad. But how? You on the nut or the slug hunt? Uh, I'm just on the hunt. I'm just looking out for stuff. What's going on over here? Like, there's weird stuff, and I just want to be a part of it. Ass gas. Once when I was a kid, my brother, he ate some chili prior to that day. He let one go. You could literally see it in the room. It was the most disturbing fucking thing. Oh, shit. Never seen anything like it. I have arrived at Rad's at Han, and holy shit, the final days are terrifying. Bruh, you thought it was gonna be like, oh hey, I did the moon stuff. Time for a nice, relaxing, fun trip. Let's talk to the Loperts for a little bit. God damn, that startles me. What is this, limestone over here? Yeah. Limestone pure. I need to kill you. Look. Whoops. Stop it. I'm sorry for your loss, but you have to die. I need your carapace for research. Whoa. <laughs> he bounce. Nice. Very. That's the other thing. I need to look for that bacon plant. The bacon mushroom. Huh? Y'all wanna go? I'll collect some of you too! Yo, get punched! Holy shit, how did I do the punch? That was fantastic. God, I'm like right between two uh, blocks. Chop a tree, it'll give you hundreds of leaves. Like I said, I'm just kind of exploring, but yeah, I, I don't worry. Don't worry, dog. What? What? Oh, no. I was using the mouse wheel to switch. That was weird. Oh, yeah! <laughs> now the question is, can I use the chainsaw on garbage enemy? Because if I can't, it's not a weapon, it does no damage. That is so sad.
don't think I didn't. I'm too good. You, you're too slow. Thank you. Uh, what is this? Iron? Iron. See, I want to go over there. That's what I want to do. I want to be over there. That looks ridiculous. Ooh, another slug. Alright, another little spitter fella. Alright, big boy, you and me. You and me. Oh shit, he can lead his shots. That's cheating. Oh my god. Run away. All right, we're just going to Breath of the Wild this re real quick. I'm going to eat 500 apples and then call it a day. God damn it, dude. <laughs> I really wish the chainsaw did damage. This does one up Subnautica in that one way though. Technically, I guess you can kill the fish in Subnautica, but it's not quite the same experience. Also, the sound of that going. Bellissimo. Pick that up. Never mind. Man, there's. How far? How far away am I right now? Oh God, where'd you come from? I didn't even see you. Thank you. You can use chainsaw on leaves. It doesn't AOE collect. That's cool. How big is this map? Oh, what is this shit? It's like something I'd see in No Man's Sky. Around eight kilometers by eight kilometers. That would, like, if only I knew how far a kilometer was in this game. <laughs> I found some water. Is this more water? Five. <laughs> oh no! Well, I knew how big a kilometer is. It was more, I don't know, in relation, like, how fast do I walk? How fast do I sprint, you know? How long will it take me to get from A to B? Bacon plant! I found a cave. The mycelia within this fungus suggests strong molecular bonding features frequently observed in adhesives and medicine, both beneficial for field research. A new research tree can now be accessed in the map. Eat. Also, I think I found the mushroom work in progress here. Oh shit. Picking up multiple fixit personnel in the area. Proceed with harvest before it's too late. Did it say multiple, multiple fix-it personnel in the area? What is that? No, no. Comply. Comply. It didn't even do anything. God damn it. Okay, so now I have two of these weird things? A Mercer Sphere work in progress. Analyzing this will not give you anything. 
Should I even pick this stuff up? It doesn't do anything for me. Is that a jape? Also, look at this shithole. I love it. This actually really does look like... Oh! Look at the weird tree. God, I want to be... It's rumored to do stuff for release. I feel like when the game actually comes out of early access, I will be starting a new file. That's usually how it goes. I do that with basically everything. But then again, I'm not out there playing a whole bunch of early access games either. I have rules about that, you know? Bruh. Don't get worked so hard. That poor bitch. We gotta make it back to the hub so I can insert fuel. So I guess we should probably be getting some leaves while we're out and about. I don't know. I feel like... Didn't I get like a hundred leaves out of one of these trees? This is a lot more stable with more content than many released games. That's kind of why I ex gave this an excuse. I excused it. Because normally, like even Hades, it, I'm a huge Supergiant Games fan. Like I love Bastion, Transistor. Didn't love Pyre, but that's a story for a different day. Even then, when they had Hades, I was like, I will wait until it's out of early access. I can do that. Overkill? I played the demo for it a while ago. That game is fun as shit. I can wait. Why am I finding so many of these? I strongly advise you to harvest this specimen. Oh shit! <laughs> I just barely heard. Oh, did you get hit by your friend? I think I figured out the trick. Yeah, I noticed the bit that it's actually like your contract legally compels you to harvest this artifact. <laughs> I noticed the bigger the tree actually counts. So that's pretty cool. Oh, this is what I was looking for. I'm gonna chop it down. <laughs> oh, look at it. Oh, I love purple. Limestone, mycelia, and silica? What the fuck? Are we cool? We're not cool! It's a mushroom biome, huh? I'm into it. It looks nice. Oh shit. Oh man. Oh man. This is, this is really cool. And this is why I chose this over Factorio. Not saying Factorio is bad. I wouldn't know. I haven't played it. But when I was reading the differences between the two, I saw that this had a semi-focus on exploration, and I said, yes, please. Because this is very neat. I 
I like just looking around weird locales. Though, I wish I could chop down whatever weird looking bulb that was. I don't much like Factorio as it's more God view and no exploration. Well, yeah, that's like I said, that's the reason I got this over that. Exploration, I love it usually in video games. Just wandering around, seeing cool locales, picking up stuff. I like that a lot. Where Factorio is much more video gamey, if that makes any sense. But I mentioned at the start of the stream, I did pick up Dyson Sphere program, so we'll see how that goes. I'm a huge space fan, so that should do something for me. Man, you guys are getting worked now. Y'all kicked my ass before. Hmm. Not a fan of the tower defense aspect, having stuff you've built destroyed. See, that part I am a fan of. And... I'd like to see it in this game, honestly, because that would make it more like Sanctum, and God, I just can't rave enough about Sanctum. I love that game. But let me get through all the content in this game before I start asking for things not in it. What is this shit? Hey there. Oops, I forgot to back up. Oh shit, that's a lot of wire. Look at that. What do you mean not enough space for? What? Uh I like the silica, the limestone can go, I guess. Flowers can go, good call, yeah. Uh, I don't even fucking see them. Sort. I don't know what the in- ah, oh, there. I don't know what the icons look like quite yet. They have explicitly said they will not add tower defense. They're aiming for this to be a more explore, build, chill game. All right, I can see that. <gasps> Emergency status. Broken battery needs 40. What? I need two biomass burners? How far are we? Because I'll fuck it. We are way too far. I'll do it. I'm just not happy about it. Alright, we don't need to feed it too much, so mycelia, biomass burners, and vehicles can... Okay. Yeah, I know. Oh shit, 90 per minute? Oh boy. A hard drive with fix-it data. Analyze it on the MAM. Data on the hard drive has been salvaged and can be repurposed to unlock an alternate recipe. Salvaging more hard drives will provide additional alternate recipes. Okay. Oh yeah, I probably could have used the uh... Not enough space for a motor? Use the flowers. That would have been a good idea. Oh, you can't shift or- Alright, well. 21 motors. 
no idea what those are used for, but I'm sure it'll be a variety of things. Reinforced iron hole platings? Absolutely. 12 of them saves me so much time. What do I toss? I think 200 mycelia will be fine. Let's see. Did you pick up the hard drive? You can also oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Thank you. Yeah, I got the hard drive. It is... There. Orders. Sorry, I'm I'm hearing something, but I'm not seeing something. It's freaking me out. You can drop the work in progress items. They're just bag fillers now. No, now I feel obligated to hold them. The game commanded me. It was uh, I command or whatever the fuck it said. That was cool. What is that? What? Are... Comply. There it is. Thank you. I'm obligated. Though I am out of space, and my factory is dead, so... Let us proceed to jumping that bitch back up, because we need 1500 wire or some shit? Is that a good voice or a mind control voice? Eh, what's the difference? Fuck off! Anything and everything is above my pay grade. Just tell me what to do and I'll do it. Bruh, you don't want this. Oh god, you're so dumb! I warned you! You could not be dead right now. Poor bastard. I like the arch. This game has some good vistas. Absolutely a plus. So cool looking. Like huge ass mount. See that mountain? You can climb it. Some stuff over there. I see some weird shit right there. I don't know what that little thing is. Hold on. B. I want to kill it. Why on earth is there a traditional dance in tag? Are you dancing right now while playing the game? The game is the dance. What up, Particularis? What up? Koo's here. Time to stop. All right. That's going to end. <laughs> I've only been streaming for four hours. Also. It's like four for you, isn't it? Heck early. What up? How you doing, Particularis? How you doing, Koo? <laughs> yeah. Got off early because engine light, bruh. Doing great. How's my day? I'm. It's going well. I was expecting to need to stumble into Sekiro. Um, or not need to stumble, but I was expecting. Sekiro to happen, and I am... I don't want to say addicted, but that might be the correct phrase for this. I am having a very good time with this game. It is a lot of fun. Alright, wood goes there. I got the biofuel that's churning and churning and churning. Got extra wire. Wire goes here? Iron ingots? I don't know what the fuck to do. I gotta turn the- I got biofuel to install. Hold on. Control click moves everything of that type to storage. Alright, cool. No? Oh god, I don't have enough biofuel. 
One of these engines is getting... Getting shafted. 60 per minute! 60! Bruh. I need to research that shit, so that's not so good. Is this really all I have? Alright, get started. Hunting dinosaurs. The only thing dinosaur I've seen... We might see one... Out and about. There it is. Is uh, this fella. Oh. Whoa. Not really a dinosaur. I don't know what it is. Outside of odd looking. But I once poked it with a stun stick and it ran. So... I want to kill it. I want to kill it real bad. So what shit the bed just now? Hold on. Okay. <laughs> uh, did I just, uh... Max... Oh god, I need another reactor! Oh, you are shitting me! Is there a second tier of production? Complete space elevator phase one. Oh my god. Oh god, here we fucking go. I might have enough. I'm actually pretty sure I have enough. Hold on. Oh yeah, I absolutely do. Oh yeah. Oh, we're good. Uh, uh, whatever. And concrete is here. Oh, yeah. All right, let's build this elevator. Shit. I didn't know I was ready for that. Where are we building it? Oh, my God. How big is it? Mm, yes, floor too steep. Clipping may occur. A split biofuel so you don't use my cell. As it currently stands, that is a, a like, yes, but also... Holy shit, this thing is big! Holy shit, this thing is big. I need a tower just to slap it down somewhere. I mean, it makes sense to slap it up here, but boy, howdy. I, I might put it over here, actually. Hold on. Bruh. Sorry, you're, you're gonna have to excuse me. This is... a whole different kind of huge. So... Let me, uh, let me get some height. Let me look around and see what's appropriate. Because while I don't have much in the way of space, this is happening. <laughs> I like it. It's just like wire and shit being thrown in. Boom.
Okay. Spice. Thank you, Tim Curry. So that was dope. Um, I don't know why it has input ports, so I'm a little freaked out about that. Space elevator resource delivery one. Project assembly platform. Delivery, delivery will unlock tier three and tier four. Status load resources. I need 50 smart platings. Oh no. That is just entire- I get vertigo looking at that! Holy shit, it's like I'm in Baltimore looking up at skyscrapers again. Yeesh! So, something triggered... Oh, the wood. I hadn't used the wood before. Uh, let me... Remove that. You are absolutely correct about splitting the stack, though. That is a smart move. Can we go up? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I'll check. Seriously, why is there... Oh, I guess it's if you have a whole bunch of stuff, you can just pipe it in without needing to actually configure. Oh, dude. No, I don't think we can go up. That would be awesome, though. Shit. No, nope, no going up. Uh. So let me see what we got going on over here. I can't even make the weird plate. Let me do this. Three seconds for this. Okay, so we can turn carapace and alien organs into biomass, so that's cool. A rebar gun? I'm interested. You can turn mushrooms into... You can make smart plating, but only in a machine... Oh, the assembler! I haven't built that thing yet. Of of course. Ah, uh, yes, the nutritional mixture. I got a whole bunch of blue, but no. All right, uh, that's five minutes to do that. I don't want to do that yet. I did not get enough quartz to do that. Uh. <gasps> Hand slot. Oh, the hard drive. That's going to take 10 minutes. I will be back. So looks like we are building a new... Shit. <laughs> looks like we are building a new generator. <laughs> I kind of have to. <laughs> Son of a bitch. How on earth am I going to add this to the fucking <laughs> assembly line of poles and power? Oh, God. I know how. I know how. That's... Ah, oh, shit. I gotta connect that to that. 
that to that, and that to that. <laughs> hey! Ugh. Yeah, there's zero chance. Zero fucking chance I get to the whole foundation thing today. It's just not happening. Because I'm continuing to build and build and build and build and build. Have I mentioned that I've been building? Because I've been fucking building. When, when, when explore? Your friend, he want to explore. Okay, so to build smart plating, you need reinforced iron plates and rotors. To make a rotor, you need rods and screws. Oh no. Maybe put the assembler on the outside, or out, yeah, that, that, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah good call. Slap you there. So what do I start with rotors, I guess? No, I think I have to start with reinforced iron plates. Oh, shit, this is bad. <laughs> Once again, the level of complexity that I just happened, because now I have screws, right? Screws in uh, here? I have screws, but screws need to be shipped out to like four different assemblers. Work out what you need for smart plating. Well, I need the rotor and I need reinforced iron plates. So that means I need iron plates and screws. So here are my screws, I think. That would make that rods and this. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, screws are far right, so that would make this plates. That would be dumb. And power. I'm going to steal power from up there. You'll need two assemblers from raw components and one assembler from two outputs. Yes. The issue is that I think I need screws twice. So that's going to be interesting. And that's fully automating that. Um, let me double check, actually. Uh, I could have... whatever. Yeah, rotor also needs screws. Tons and tons and tons of screws! So that means the screws needs to, uh, to Q, assembler. What was the other thing I needed? Shit. Or I'll just build it. I need a goddamn rotor! Alright, step by step. Yeah, I need a splitter for the screws. Hello, friend. Alright, you. Five per minute. Oh, God. I need a goddamn rotor. <laughs> Iron rods. I can I can just uh, supply it. I can just supply it. It's fine. Well, we're gonna be here for. Uh, well, I take the one rotor and then we're gonna be here for a little bit because I'm just gonna let them ride. So take the one. Assembler. 
Pets. So let's do... I've already got that set up, so let's just do that. Nope. Nope. Logistics. Merger. Nope. Splitter. At every turn, I am being demolished, and it is hilarious. Alright, so... Here? In... Nope, nope, nope. I need a lift. I need that lift to be a little taller. This is crazy as shit. The fuck you mean? What do you mean the floor is too steep? Oh, I all right, never mind. We're good. That needs to be straight. Oh god. Okay, I have to redo that one. It's fine. Okay, okay, chill out. Ch no! No! Stop! <laughs> Yeesh! No, wait, what? What happened there? Oh god, this is crazy as shit. Alright, there we go. There we go! Connected like that. Thank god! Yeah, the splitter was off the belt because I didn't use control. That was interesting. Alright. Grab all that, take that, switch to recipes, make reinforced iron plates. Thank you! Uh, no power. Okay, that's happening. And then I guess I need one more assembler, huh? Feeling good, feeling great. Feeling great, feeling good. How are you? What a nightmare hellscape. <laughs> Why is that yellow? Oh, it's waiting for screws. Oh god, it's not getting screws at any kind of rate. You can turn your wooden machine back on now? Good point. <laughs> Every everything's good. What did I do? 
Max co- 143. Oh my god, I can't turn shit back on, bro. I can't turn shit back on. I hadn't even gotten around to doing it yet. Oh my god. Looks like I'm making another fucking generator. This is crazy. This is fun. Right, I need to, uh, that, rid of that. Connect there, that connects there, that connects there, and that connects there. Did I get any biomass at all? Yeah, actually I have plenty. Okay. Well, what is my max output now? One sixty. We're in the green. <laughs> Even with the- no, no, the wood is still off. Hold on. Oh god, do I not have it connected? Oh god, you're not connected. What are you supposed to be connected to? This one. This is a shit show. This is a certified, verifiable shit show. And I love it. Let me go check my ma'am. My favorite part, if I'm here, you know, at the hub or whatever, I can just, oop, I see that <laughs> every time. <laughs> oh, best part. Conveyor belt mark two. What do I need? I need reinforced iron plating. I need fucking iron rods and I need normal plates. Wait, do I have to redo all of the fucking conveyor belts when I do this? You can upgrade them in place. Okay. It was a. Uh, I'll just go ahead and make this since the other stuff is supposed to be used for the. Uh... Oh god, my brain. The special plating or whatever. I gotta ship that shit to the moon. And as we all know, the moon's haunted. Mm, yes. We only need to get to 50. I like that I stole all of the uh, iron plates, though. I say stole. It's, like, it's my shit. Why am I saying stole? Too many Endwalker players on the moon these days. The moon's haunted, bro. I did not have. I used too many plates. I have. I have to wait now. Well, that's not good. <laughs> gonna steal a whole bunch of that real quick. That's not enough. You have ore and chests. Oh yeah, good call. I do. Wait, which one of these shits is copper? That shits is copper. We 
never gonna be here a while. Oh yeah, I forgot I have a whole bunch of ingots to begin with. Is there a way to lower the amount, like, cap the amount of materials allowed into an assembler or something like that? Because if I can cap the amount of iron plates in the assembler, it'll stop attempting to steal the one. I say steal. It'll stop attempting to steal the ones I already have. Have you researched overclocking yet? Not yet, though my man came back, so I can do that now. Though by the sounds of it, it's going to be wonderful. Hmm. I can't wait to get back out and explore again. <laughs> and that's exactly how you do that. Nice. I'm gonna do that then. Analysis complete. Uh. Uh. Select your desired reward. Copper rotor, cast screw. I. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking the five ingots to twenty screws. High tier. Though my screw for production facilities are over here. So that means I... Wait, that just skips a step. I can delete two of these. Hold up. That's the good shit. Oh, wait. <laughs> uh, that was a little wrong. Let me queue and then production. Nope. Logistics conveyor belt. Same thing. They need to be the same height. It's gonna. Freak me out if they're not. All right. It's so lucky that one eludes me every time. Oh, how many are there? Do you get a whole bunch of options? All right, whatever. Good enough. I don't care. Oh my god, I need plates. I have no plates. Wait, what? I have no plates. Oh, that's 180. Oh, my bad. I have no plates. 96 recipes. Bruh. Holy shit. Alright, that's enough. I mean, it's not enough. I gotta go back to crafting, but I need to connect that first. Because we just... Oh, that's so nice being able to tone that down. That's 8 megawatts we just cut out of the... Cut out of this shit. Not only that, but I don't think I want them split now. I think I want two different... Cause they're gonna log jam, right? I don't want them to log jam. I need the screws. They're not log jamming yet. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, I think I just want two different pathways to go to two different containers. Mark two belts. Good call. Good call. Good call. Yep, 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 yep. And points, which means we're going to be crafting for a little bit. Whee! Press space and let it ride. I need 112 of these shits. Does that thing say I have 3,000 screws? Or I can make 3,000 screws. Alright, never mind, we're good. 
You start research on overclocking. I did not. I panicked. <laughs> I didn't panic, but I, I saw the thing and forgot. <laughs> Thank you. No, my plates. I just made you. I'm gonna go steal, once again, I'm gonna go steal the plates from the assembler here in a minute. I just gotta finish crafting. Now my plates aren't being used at an overt rate. It's just, uh, I didn't, I didn't mean for that to sound so sassy. They're not being over, overused. It's just, this thing holds a ton and it's not using a ton. So. So how are we looking on smart plating? All right. The rotors are coming out soft. Why are the rotors coming out soft? Screws. All the time, the screws. Can have that. Start crafting, bitch. And then add in the rest of that. Hit the button! Milestone reached. Improved versions of conveyor belts and conveyor lifts are now accessible. To encourage additional verticality, conveyor poles now have a stackable variant. <gasps> Reinforced! And you got the god mode conveyor poles. I'm not entirely sure what that means. Stackable conveyor pole. Does that mean they can go real high? That reinforced plating, that's a shit. Well, the most important thing here is getting enough to do these screws. No, it takes so many. It takes so many. I'm going to need 30 or 40 of these things. Oh, no. That's the one I really need. Is the screws? I guess I don't need it. I am. It's just kind of their log jam, you know? I do have plenty of screws, though. Like, that's okay. That will require me. I am gonna have to use this other one to make more plating. I have this sneaky suspicion. Either that, or I'm gonna need another recipe for this shit. So is this where I start from scratch? I bulldoze everything? Start from fucking scratch? Let me, uh... Try stackable conveyor pole. Alright, give me a sec. All right, so that's my hotkey, right? Uh, stack all conveyor ball. Place two down, one on top of each other, and then run a short distance away and make a second stack. So what do you mean by make a second stack? 
one here? Further away, okay. So what are we talking, like industrial grade length now? Stop trying to loop. It's, I can't tell distances. I have no fucking clue how far away I am. Where did you come from? It's too far. This is far enough. Oh, shit. That's what it meant by stackable. I see. Oh, that's just fantastic. Oh, that's just fantastic. Neat. How I'm going to incorporate this is beyond me, but it is very neat. I really have no fucking clue how I'm going to incorporate this. It's just all of this is just got to get redone as I get more and more new stuff. The idea of how the base needs to be built ever evolves. This is my one problem. I had this problem with Frostpunk and I had this problem with uh, Oxygen Not Included. Is that I get this idea of what's better and then everything's got to get scrapped. So your screws output won't need to land on the building. I just kind of like the aesthetic of it landing on the building, honestly. <laughs> but you are right, yeah. I mean, you can take two different things from really far away and stack them on top of each other, so that way they take up less horizontal space and more vertical. Which then begs the question, can I stack containers vertically? Uh. Oh. Well, that's different. Huh. That's gonna be a little fun. Let the stacking game begin. Stack them with the outputs next to the inputs. Uh, I'm not so like, like that. So that I got, now I'll connect the lift. That didn't work. It was it did not appreciate. Oh yeah, look at that. So if you fill up if you have like an excess screws, like the screws start filling up, you can stack on top, connect it through a lift in the back. And you'll have twice the space. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, that is so... This is going... 
You know, I keep saying the same things over and over. This game's going to turn into a shit show for me. I mean, let's be real. I'm at this for like, what, five hours now and it's already a shit show? I was, how you doing, Keffel? To dismantle that. I need the materials right now. I'm just waiting on... Uh... This shit, I need 50 of this. So... I've still got... Four, no, not four, two per minute. I need four, seven minutes. Assuming I have 100% uptime on it, which is not a good assumption. Let me make sure this shit show has enough fuel. Stab. I need to clean out the inventory and then I'm gonna go looking around for stuff. That's good. Hope your Christmas was well. Maybe spend some time getting some wooden leaves. That would be, yes, the correct idea. Uh, I need to clean up my inventory. Let's get that shit. Why do I have so many iron rods? Excuse me? Go put my shit away. Well, no, not all of the shit. Some of the shit. Did I ever... Oh, God. What have I done? I don't know what I have and have not done now. Right, there's that. The motors get put away, the iron ingots get put away, the concrete stays. I don't know what silica is used for. Those get put away. It's much more convenient when you can automate energy completely. Oh, I would imagine. I'm gonna find coal someday. Those away. I'm gonna collect those anyway. The that can be trashed. Go. So I have. Uh, that's for chainsaw, so I'm gonna keep that. Cables for crafting on the fly. Motor gets put away. Ironing gets get put away. Like, uh, and the bug. Deuterium quartz. And the rest can stay. Let's go explore. Have fun. Don't die. Slugs you can convert, you already got the recipe. I will do that later. Because I don't know what to do with the power thing anyway, so... And I'm not hurting on space, I just needed it out of my inventory. Let's see, I went that way last time. It does not look like I can explore... Well, maybe. Maybe. Oh, those are trees. <laughs> oh, the trees. <laughs> Fantastic. We are gonna. Oh, I really want to go. Want to go over there so bad. But for now. Chop them up. Holy shit. Big tree's good. Wait a second. What is this? Did I just pick up the damn berry? Oh shit! <laughs> uh-uh. Get out of here and give me your carapace, asshole. I knew he was there, but I didn't know he was there, you know what I mean? Bacon. It really was some jump scare shit. I ain't about it. Ah. Uh. Alright, you want some too? Both of you? Nah, uh, uh <laughs> nope. Get out of my face. No thank you. I mean, is there a different way to pronounce that? As far as I'm aware, it says bacon agaric, right? The idea being that it looks like bacon? Oh, look at the little bird fella. I like the little bird fella, he's weird. Oh, 
Oh, golden bug. I've been looking for you. Ow. Ow! Oh, you're big! I didn't even realize! <laughs> He's big. So, uh, my whole- yeah. At least it wasn't that far. It's not like I died way over there or something. Oh god. I assume you can reset your spawn point? Or, you know, like, move it? Or have, like, multiple spawn points? Move the hub, okay. Yeah, what if I build multiple hubs? When I die, can I choose where I respawn? You only get one hub, shit. I gotta collect my stuff and then rodeo the rhino. I had no idea. I had... I could not tell at all that he was bigger. Ow! Shit! Not only is he bigger, but he is way faster! And I don't think he cares about the stun gun. I'm unsure though. Though I am dead again. Well, as they say, you win some, you lose some. You only need the hub for milestones. So I'm worried, like, all right. So I'm building something, some automated machine a thousand kilometers away or something. And all of a sudden, another big boy shows up, but he's got like an army of flying pterodactyls spitting acid, right? And I end up dead and I spawn way back over here. I ain't trying to walk that, you know what I mean? I ain't trying to walk this off. That's when you hop on, or that's when you hope you built the train. There's a train? Shit. I mean, I figured there'd be some kind of like movement stuff. I want a jetpack. Give me a jetpack. I want to. I want to scale walls and shit. Uh, is the big boy still here? I can't see him. Sorry, I, I... Oh. That's, like, I, I get... I don't know how to put it. Shit! Hmm. It is. I need that bug. There's a glowy. What is this? What is this? What is this? No, stop. When do I get gun? Come on, come on. he left that's what I 
thought. All right, I need this bug. So, like, I saw the bug. It's important. So I'm going to have to... All right, baby. <gasps> oh my god. All right. All right. You can have the bug. It's your bug. You it's your bug friend. Your bug. Not my bug. Your bug. You win. All right, I'm hopped up on berries. My bug. Uh. I'm hopped up on more berries. Come here, bitch. <laughs> Zap him right in the asshole. <laughs> a zombie through him. God damn, you were a fat boy. Now, I reap reward. Yellow power. Yellow slug. Thank you. Okay, that was... experience. Jeez. I better get upgraded weapons. <laughs> that was ridiculous. What is going on over there? There's some stuff on that island. How does one build a bridge? And then, how does one get over it? Foundations, huh? Now, is there a way to, like, like in Minecraft, you know, you can hold the button and you won't fall off and you can just craft sideways? Press R. What is Zoop? <laughs> what is Zoop? What does this mean? I have vertical, I have default, and I got zoop. What? All right, well, this is working out. Maybe not the most efficient way of doing things, and I'm going to run out of concrete. Well before I get over there. But wait, I can hold on. No, 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 I got this. The trick is to make a to destroy as I advance, right? This is totally how physics work, by the way. I'm definitely not gaming the system, it's the game's fault for allowing me to do this. Right? It's not my fault. Oh my god. I just realized I'm playing Fortnite. Oh, Jesus Christ. How did I sink this low? <laughs>
next level strats, press once and then move them. Oh! Oh, shit. Oh my god! Absolutely fantastic. Zoop. Oh shit. <laughs> I, I gotta circle around a little bit. No, no, no. Ramp, use a ramp. Oh, that's right. I forgot about ramps, but that's all right. We already built it. More screws. More wire. I'm gonna have to build a generator, aren't I? I don't think that's supposed to be like that. Yeah, needs five much. <gasps> I would have preferred the generator. Oh, put down the crafting bench. Oh, good call, good call. Uh, craft bench. I have enough for two! I need reinforced. I have enough of that. All right, we're good. Nice. Good looking out. Because I would not have thought about doing that. That's probably enough. How many? It's at five, right? Ugh. Individual placements default mode. What is... So, a vertical that's only up and down, then? Oh, shit. So, can John Satisfactory swim? Down there. <gasps> it's a purple bug. It's a fucking purple bug. Uh, I want the purple bug. That's a pain in the dick, though. But Zoop. We have the power of Zoop. Ramp down. Oh, yeah, we can ramp down. I wouldn't, I mean, follow your dream, but leave your stuff here. Do I even have stuff? All of this is mostly replaceable. I could start from over there. I think that's the right call. Alright, time to zoop. Oh, that is just brilliant. Oh, so good. Why? What is that? I mean, it's obviously an ore vein, but like... Just chilling there? One? I had to make sure I didn't target the one under my feet. Ooh. That would have been some shit. Okay. Uh, ramp. Yeah, look at that. That was easy. Oh, it's Katerium. No! All right. 
get punched. Fuck you, bug. Where'd the other one go? There you are, you little shit. Alright, cool. Alright, uh... Almost there, let's delete the shit. Yes. Oh, I want that purple bug so bad. I have no idea what it gives. I just want it. So this is like a normal thing that like every player would do, right? They, they would game the system like this, build, build some stuff. It doesn't need found, like it doesn't need to hit the ground. It just kind of floats there and they let it happen. Like everyone does this, right? Foundation. I'd say intended design. All right, cool. This is building and satisfactory. You aren't gaming anything. This is the design. I don't know. It just feels zoop it. How far down do I need to go? Fuck it. No. It, oh, I thought it built backwards. <laughs> this is actually fucking terrifying. I'm not gonna lie. See, we say zoop the ramps, but I'm just apprehensive about zooping anything. Because there is the real possibility that your boy dies. Your boy don't die. Don't worry. Just like everything else, I'm a zoop up and down. Up and down, up and down. There, one there. Is that that's not steep enough? Shit. I need to go further down. Okay. A ramp. Let's try that. Do you suffer from vertigo? Uh kinda. <laughs> I've gotten vertigo before, saying, like, I don't know. I definitely don't enjoy heights so much. Heights freak me out a wee bit. Oh. I remember once I went to the Grand Canyon, and, uh... There, there's a bridge that goes across the motherfucker. And I was not happy. Whew. Magic, you're doing that thing where you're making me consider purchasing a game. <laughs> Can you kindly stop that, please? And thanks. Skybridge glass. No, it wasn't. Uh, I don't know if that was there at the time, but it was a um, it was a walking bridge. But it wasn't, it was like just big enough for maybe a small car to go through. Purple power slip, by the way. But it, it wasn't, it wasn't like the, the girthiest part of the Grand Canyon. It was a rat. Sorry, I had to step back to check. I wasn't deleting my hopes and dreams. And it's all right. So me being scared of heights is actually an interesting story. Oh my god! <laughs> I thought there was more real estate there. So, as I was saying, 
me being scared of heights is actually an interesting story because I was never actually afraid of heights. Uh, when I was a kid, I used to go visit my mother and occasionally we would go across the James River in Virginia, which is a, a fairly wide river. It's like a mile long and I just never wanted to go on that trip. So to go across the river, you'd have to go along this mile long bridge. And I just told people that I was afraid of heights so that I didn't have to go across the bridge on this stupid car ride. And I guess eventually I told enough people that it became real. Which was interesting. So you can kind of will yourself into a uh, shit like that. Also, I'd like to note the power has not gone out a single time while I've been out and about. Feels good, man. Zoop the ram. Safety. The other thing with Zoop is not stepping on platform when it's still building. Is it ethereal while it's building? Oh, the one two. The one two. Shit. He got me back. Huh? Huh? Oh, I don't think I got. Where did the third one come from? You motherfucker, I will beat my head against the wall. Asshole. Okay, so, uh... Yeah. That was fun. Turn those into biomass, absolutely. Overclock is done. I need... 35... Reinforced plates? Oh, yes. While I was out and about, the production ramped. I got all the stuff. Oh, reinforced plates. It should be here, right? Yeah. Take some of those. 19 back. Oh, God. <laughs> I can't navigate. You have smart, smart plates now. Good call. Yes. I was so focused on getting that stuff for the yellow thing that, yes, I do have the smart plates. Boop. Let's do that. We gotta send it into space. This is only complete phase one. There's gonna be like 50 phases to this. This is fine. We got tier three and four. Cool. I fucking knew it. Oh boy, we need a lot of stuff. And I am almost out of water. And I have been streaming for five and a half hours. <laughs> Hello. That is <laughs> way longer than I normally stream. Let's see. Coal generator, water extractor. 
attracts water from body water it's built on. Not that the water needs to be deep enough that the rivers do not commonly suffice. What about the geyser that I found? Fluid buffer? Pipeline pump, scanner update coal. Burns coal to boil water, then it uh, produces steam, rotates turbines. So it's a steam generator, just with coal power. Okay. Oh, transport! Truck! That's what I'm nicknamed the Sugar Cube. <laughs> it's pretty sweet, you know. Takes a hundred rotors. So I can see uh, this is small time. I mean, I knew it was small time, but also this is small time. Um, I'm going to need like five or six of these things cranking out rotors. Considering rotors are like, what, 10 a minute or something like that? Not even that. It's got to be less than that. I ride this bitch. <laughs> I need a personal lift. Four per minute, and I need only a couple hundred. Um. Oh, wait. How many reinforced plates do I have? So foundations, then start planning. Uh, as it stands, the foundations things will be next stream. Uh, I'm not gonna do that now. power shards. What do I do with power shards? I have no fucking clue what I do. Check out what you can craft with slugs. It's just the, the power shard thing, right? And make a bunch of modular things. God, it takes reinforced iron plates? Eat a dick. Craft them from slugs, then you'll see. I have a couple. Um, I see. I want to get the purple recipe down. You can stick slugs in chest. I'm gonna do the purple power slug thing. I just gotta make a whole bunch of these goddamn modular frames. Which, oh god. Yeah. Just a whole bunch more. Uh, you stuck your spare slugs in your chest before you went out. Yeah. Those two. I mean, I, I already did switch or like use these. I, I do have a power shard. I just I got two there. It says it radiates strange power. Go to a miner. Oh, <gasps> the overclock. Oh, shit. Is that permanent? You slap a power shard in, you get super production? Oh, snap. And you can overclock anything. Oh, no. Uh, then I know exactly what the fuck I'm overclocking. That's 10 more plates per minute. No, that's not. Yeah, it is.
So, how I triggered? Oh, overclock. It says... Hold on. Use a lot of power on constructors, so always best to just mines and add extra mean machines. Oh, yeah, the 50% almost doubled my watts. Holy shit. I can spare it for now, though. It's the screws are backlogged. That's 100% log jammed. All right. I would need 200% on that bad boy. Um, what's my freaking grid look like? Uh, 147. If you double the miner's production, you can split into extra smelters and get more production going from one mine. That would be the ideal, yes. Uh, as it stands now, I have a log jam in multiple productors. So I'd have to make the smelter, and that's gonna happen when I redo all the foundations. Yeah, that seems appropriate. If I destroy this, do I get the power shard back? Okay, cool. Okay! A leaf. Wood. And screws. You always get 100% back unless it overflows your inventory then ends up in a chest in the spot you deleted the thing. <gasps> Overflow loot bag! We morrowind! Oh shit. Uh, why do I only have 159 screws? Am I an idiot? How many reinforced arm blades have I ever made? Oh, shit. And I need eight more of this? So I need four cents, 12 each. Okay, no, this is fine. Okay, so 12. We're okay. I thought it was a lot worse. Oh god, I need to stop streaming soon. Remember, you have the whole map to get resources from. Oh yeah, I know there will be no shortage of shit. I've seen how big this map is. And I'm sure someone out there has leveled the whole fucking landscape. <laughs> if, if I had the gumption in me, if I had the conness, I would also level the whole landscape, and that would be great. Just fantastic. Purple power shard. Beautiful. Oh, I get five out of this thing? Oh, I already used it. <laughs> I already used it for the research. Feels bad. The Andrew 75 made a map where he got every single node on the map shipped back to Central Mass Factory on multiple floors. See, that's what I'm talking about. Like, there, there are people out there with supreme gumption who just do it because they can. Crazy assholes. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna take ten minutes. I need more of that. What does this sort, though? Wires can go... Need to re-up on this. 
good. Re up on plates. I probably don't have any. The limestone. What's 15 limestone? Just get out of my inventory. Concrete. Yeah, I'm never going to have plates. Even at 50% rate, the plates are just going to get eight. Research the hard drive now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you unlocked the sink yet? No, I have not. What are you doing here? I did not realize the assemblers were 15 fucking megawatts. Yeesh. All right, well, that's going swimmingly. That's going swimmingly. That's an alternate way of dropping stuff that gives you stuff back. Not sure what exactly what that means, but I, I think it's like a storage thing or something. Turn stuff you don't want into other useful things. Ah. All right, let's add a hundred to each of these so that I don't have to worry about them for a while. Jump pads, yeah, the resources sink. Hey, I need iron plates. I'm never getting those ever again. <laughs> I'm about ready to turn these rods into plates real quick. That's not a bad idea, right? Get out of here. Just temporarily. Just temporarily. Uh... So I just, I don't want to, uh... Can it not do a diagonal? There it goes. That's... Let's click that first. No more. Wait. Twice the production. Here we go. Point your mouse onto the belt, not below it. Yeah, that's... It, it's... I... Once again, I got the in and out confused. <laughs> I don't know why. I mean, I know I'm in... <laughs> Desk. Sorry, one moment. That's yeah, gonna have to get cleaned up later. Hello again. Yeah, that's gonna be, be cleaned. Okay. Um. What was I saying? Iron plates. Screws. Biomass. Are we already out of fuel? What? It's already out of fuel? Oh, it already put the wood in. Nice. <laughs> it's being shipped out as quickly as it goes in. Oh no. Yeah, because I need to ramp this up for the second phase of making stuff. You know what I mean? Everything's got to get ramped. But there's probably alternate means. Not means. Um, There's more I can unlock to make things easier. Let's see. Coal power would be crazy good. Steel, I'm not entirely sure. Smelts two resources into alloy ingots. I'm sure that's going to be useful. Steel beams. 
Versatile framework. I see that up at the top right. Yep, 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 yep. <gasps> Melee combat. Oh shit. The Xeno Basher. Logistics Mark III, Mark III conveyor belts. Stackable pipelines, for, that's for coal. Um, I just need plates. That's so many goddamn plates. I think that's the extent of what I'm going to be able to do this stream without destroying everything. I mean, I guess I could explore while it just does its stuff, but that seems counterproductive for how much... Because I just, I gotta revamp fucking, like, everything here. I can delete the space elevator, yes? Yes. I, I like where I am. I just need to put the foundations down and then reset up all of the, uh, you know, stuff. I like this game a lot. And I'm glad I bought it. And I'm glad you guys could join, if, join me for today. But I've been streaming for almost six hours and I need to stop. So. Get the other mode. Yeah, there's two over there. There's one up there. Um, the other node right there. Yeah. I might play this a little in my own time. We'll see. I don't know. But I'm gonna I'm gonna be done. Uh I tend to not play the same game two days in a row, like normally I do in every other day schedule. Um So there is a chance I will play this tomorrow because I am quite addicted. But if not, it'll be between Sekiro and Baba Is You. So if you wanna see that, feel free to tune in for that. And I stream same time every every weekday 3 p.m eastern so uh yeah go enjoy the rest of your evening i'm going to as well a little hungry i appreciate it need is a strong word need is a strong word is this the new detroit i don't know something changed recently in my video gaming habits because there are many i made the rule that i do every other day to to not burn myself out and something changed. I don't know. I just... I haven't been able to get burned out like I used to be. Well, we'll see. It's 11.30 p.m. here. Ah, you out across the pond. Yeah, it's uh, 6.30 for me right now. So uh, I usually stream 3 p.m. Eastern every day, which is... Uh, 8.30 your time. But today I started way earlier, and I might start way earlier tomorrow, too, so we'll see. Scotland, nice. <laughs> you're feeling it, you're feeling it. That's about right. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go eat some food and then relax. And hopefully you guys enjoy yourselves, too. So, uh, is there anyone? I don't really No, No one's on. So go, go be good. Or don't. I don't know. Bye-bye, friends. Look at this majesty, though. And I'm telling you, I'm going to build into the sky so much, and I'm going to drop a box on that motherfucker's head. It's going to crash into the ground and 